Mudahar, Willie Mac Show, Legend of Winning. Me, what do all of these people have in common? Well, we were all competing to determine who is the best commentary channel scientifically. Kick or Keep is a game show on Destiny's Kick channel. The whole meme behind it is that the host, Q, brings a bunch of topics to the table, questions to debate. The audience then votes on who does the best in that round. Each round, the winner votes to kick someone else off of the stream, and everyone is eliminated until there is one left, who is the winner. I was invited to compete with fellow commentary channels, and honestly, guys, I was a bit aggressive. I was a, I was a tad intense, okay? I did go off a bit, and this is not how I normally act, as you guys know, but I just, I just wanted to win really, really really badly okay i wanted to prove that i'm the best commentary channel scientifically okay guys this is science and in the end i did actually end up winning enjoy but you also lost i'm sorry oh! Hey. Oh! congratulations to turkey time man congratulations oh to the white man get again winning. okay turkey will you turn your camera on please yeah are you molding bro this says that sky william i did not say that are you molding bro <laughs> Look how fucking jacked Mad he is. Jacked, by the way. <laughs> yeah, Tom, let's show off the muscles. Oh my god. Holy oh, shit, he's actually kind of big, bro. Tom, you get plus 20 okay. votes for the first round. Good job. Congratulations. Okay, we're not, we're not doing that this is that week. The first round? Yeah, we're not doing that this week. Okay. You got plus 20 okay. votes. Good job, dude. Yo. Dude, I don't know. I feel like commentators can't be jacked. This needs to be like a rule. That's, why I, that's why I have to be. You pick or choose. You're either a keyboard warrior or you're I'm not. I'm literally the only one. I tried to get Bo Blacks into it. And he was like, he, uh, he, like, oh, like, dude, I'd be I so not, scared of the Bo Blacks. Do content with Bo yes, That guy is one of the most. I don't actually know how he survived on the internet. Why? He's the goat. Did he beat you in two debates? You hate him, bro. The oh, goat of being retarded. It's, I've never seen somebody be so consistently <laughs> stupid on every single issue. Oh my god, bro. He has a he's disorder. A he has a he's disorder. a little he's autistic, he's he's a little autistic bro. Come on. We, we had a conversation last stream yeah, about he's not, he's abusing awesome. the mentally ill on stream. He's not autistic. He's Okay? <laughs> Somebody with Down syndrome. That's autistic, what's okay? the difference? Okay, well, the point of bringing him up is I tried oh to get God. him to do a pull up and he couldn't do one. And I told him we need to get him in the gym and he just bitch. took a weed edible instead. So I don't even friend. believe what you're saying. I think if you were to tell him to do a pull up, I don't think he would even know what a pull up is. I think he's after. Oh, he tried, bro. He tried. What is, what is the retarded. what is the beef here, bro? What happened? To exactly. No what beef. the? None of you seem to like the guy. What the I like that. He's, 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 he's a nice guy. guy. He shits Destiny on fucking. Just doesn't like. He, he shits Destiny, on if you hate like Bo Blacks, Pokemane, you just take her on tweets, Destiny bro. is unwilling to do. Okay, he's unwilling to call out women for using their body uh, to get more views, and Bo Blacks is the only one willing to do that. He gets shit on on Twitter for that. People say he lied. Women. Women. Bo Blacks is one of the bravest. Can you imagine attacking? Bo Blacks is the bravest incel I've ever met. God, we've got Bo Black to come out and do this for us. Oh He's my the people's God. champ. He's an artist. His He's Twitter recaps, bro. Twitter. Okay, guys, let's start the show. Let's start. Okay. <clears throat> Nobody interrupt me, please. And this time, I will not forget to do the intros. I'm not gonna make Good it job. four yeah. weeks in a row. Okay. Bro, you didn't even um, reach out to me. You're a producer, bro. Okay. First of all, Ooh. I have people to reach out to other people. Okay. Dude, it's your job. That's how bro. we do it. Okay, it's my job to delegate. There you go. Congratulations. First of all, how the f do you know this? What the f Stop, stop. Let's not get into this. Using big words. Okay. Because I just know a <laughs> employee when I see you have one. Money. You won't even show your Stop no, that no, dick. No. I'm a Stop oh, trying to come at me. You're probably not even an employee. You're probably a contractor. You have no health insurance. Brother, bitch. you look like a budget moist critical, okay? Shut the f up. I Let me get on with the intro. You do look like that. <laughs> That's me. I'm literally him, bro. I'm trying okay. to channel. Moist critical. Oh, I'm surprised all of you guys turned the cameras on. Like, I'm pretty used sure to commentary really? people just keeping the camera off. Anyways, let's get on disgusting. with the intro. Nobody can question. Moment. Stop interrupting me, okay? Let's let's. Shut the f up. I'm joking. I'm joking. Yeah, Sorry. there you go. Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to episode 12 of Kick or Keep. Today, there I say, ladies and gentlemen, we have brought together the best eight man, man crew. Today, they'll be going head-to-head -head in an elimination style debate show where you, the audience, gets to decide who to kick or keep. No, I wasn't Spurgeon, by the way. I just, you know, I'm dyslexic. Anyways, the show is very simple. We'll give you a topic. You'll have 25 minutes to go through the topic, right? At the end, mm -hmm. we'll put a straw poll in kick chat. The contestant with the highest amount of votes gets to decide who to kick and who to keep. With all that being said and done, it's very simple. That's the only rule. Also, the other rule is if I talk... Or Lil Steve, aka Destiny Talks, don't talk over us. That's pretty much it, okay? With all that being said and done, I'm your host, kick.com slash Carantos. Joining me today is 
Kenneth Bonnell, Stephen the third, say hi. What's up, hi. Stephen? Ken! What? Delay time on you, holy hey, shit. Hey, I already what said you're doing emails. Do I have to pay attention to this? Are you serious? What do you yes, you have to pay attention. Holy shit. That's the only thing I want you to do. Okay. Guys, is there any questions before you get on with the intro? Why are you guys? Any questions? Is Steven competing with us today? Or or what? No, he's not. No, I can't. Then why is there two hosts? Nobody's going to want to be on the show because you'd all lose. No, there's one real okay. host and then the other one mm, does emails. We're going like to turn the libtards today. We're going to get them all going the other way. for you the whole time? Yeah, he pretty much does my emails. No, that's Kelly's True. the one that does free work for Kronos, not me. Okay, <laughs> shut the f up, you <laughs> idiot. Anyways. Anyways, guys, let's get on with the intros, okay? Top left. Professional boxer. Six foot two. I made that up. I don't know if he is. Nah, he's like uh, five nine. Very long face. Can I do my intro? I don't know who just spoke, but it's your last chance, buddy. Okay. Six two. <laughs> Apparently has Xena offering her virginity to him, aka Sneeko's ex-girlfriend. Pretty weird. I mean, she did tell me to tell you, hey, beat his ass up for me. We've got Brandon Buckingham. Go ahead and introduce yourself, please. Uh, you just did a pretty good job. I mean, I appreciate you guys having me. Thanks for being here with me. There you go. There you go. Lovely Riz. Was I supposed to have like a, a something prepared? No, 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 you don't. Yeah, bro, you're putting us on the spot now. What the f I mean, yeah, that's YouTuber. the point. You guys are commentary channels. I'm sorry you don't have YouTube editing to hide behind. I'm gonna need you guys oh, to, you know, true. be able to speak for yourself. We got YouTubers here. If it makes you guys feel any better, just pretend that we're recording and we'll release the episode later. So we'll cut all the jokes. Sorry, if that makes you feel better. Yeah, repeat oh, yourself like ten times. Who cares? Yeah. Yeah. Excuse us for having any tape. modicum of production value instead of twenty four seven streaming our. <laughs> hey, we could just <laughs> read Twitter. <laughs> like, yeah. 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 You just play League of Legends and are silent while you steal my content. You piece of. All right. Okay, Michael Bay, Christopher Nolan. That's why. Him, okay, I put thousands of dollars into my work and you just sit around and jack off, okay? So us to only somebody's gotta feed people. Come on. Okay. Yeah, it's me. He doesn't feed anyone, okay? Turkey! Sorry. I'm talking. You're breaking rule number two. There's only two. Holy to the right of Brandon and above Muda. Wait, I shouldn't have said your name. We're gonna get to you. Wait. We've got a man who actually dressed up for the show. I truly appreciate it. Fox Akimbo. Go ahead and introduce yourself. You should turn How's your phone sideways, bro. Uh, apparently, my audio is a lot worse if I do that. I'm not going to lie. I, I, <laughs> what? Lie. How does that make any uh, sense? I don't know. I don't know. Um, my name is Fox Akimbo. I've got a YouTube channel. Uh, I do kind of commentary, documentary stuff. Um, representing Europe tonight, because I guess this is a panel of Americans and stuff, and I was asked to... Whoa, whoa, whoa. Uh, don't... Offend me with that? <laughs> Jesus I'm Christ! Just, I'm, I'm, just saying, saying, yeah. I'm, I'm representing, fuck? so I, I think I'm that's not probably retarded. about it. To be fair, <laughs> nice queef, bro. Who said that? Who said that? I mean, quiff. That's me. You're nice. That's me. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, three thousand. Okay. <laughs> Whoa! Actually, hey. Uh, no, 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 I don't make enough of that. <laughs> okay, Fox. Thank you for coming on. Below Brandon, and above me. There's plenty I can say about this man. He's one half of playback. You know what I mean? Beard, a bit patchy. Glasses, approved. Hairline, could visit Turkey. Oh, well, I'm trying to make introductions. Why the f are you cutting me off? Hold on, bro. Brandon's got something going on in the f It got my attention. What the fuck? He's just my friend. That's his dad. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Like, dad, I'm entertaining your friend. I'm not elderly. Stop. We got My grandpa. legend of winning, a.k.a. Low. Go ahead and introduce yourself. Yo, look, if you don't know me that well, you can, you can just say one half a play. Brother, I watched play. playback. All, I know All the, all I the know other you. things that you were I saying were you. just completely unnecessary. <laughs> but, yo, thank y'all for having me. Yes, one one half a playback, legend of winning, a.k.a. Low. Thank y'all. Thank you for the dono. Oh, you were playback. No, I'm just, just one half of it. Is that a fat joke? No, 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 no. no, no, no. That's, that's oh, okay, okay, cool, cool. All right, no. Oh, no. <laughs> well, we got hey, some clearly, fragility we know his soft spot. Oh, Yeah, Jen. we got his soft spot already. Okay. <laughs> Holy. To the right of low and below Dest Tiny. Actually, watch some of Why your videos. You to, like, prepare for the... No, below you because... The longest intro you ever, bro. These are the longest You were doing... Intro. Yeah. Brother, we're trying to get to four hours. You think it's easy? Okay. Oh. So, okay. Oh, four hours. Four hour? This is a four hour thing? It's not, not for you. <laughs> no, <laughs> see, not for me. 
Hey, no, vote for me because out. you can't hey, be around one. In 30 minutes. Four hours. hours. You can't be. You can't be. Not four hours. It's three hours on a good day. Anyways. Li I, I don't want to say Linux because it's not Linux. Le it's Linux. Le it's Linux. Linux. It doesn't it's even Linux. do Linux. No, you can literally put your mouth it's over Linux. his name and it's see it. I, I could see his name, but not it's like... Linux. I'm I get like I told you I'm slightly <laughs> dyslexic I can't read. We got Lyrix. Go ahead and introduce yourself, my man. Hello, I'm Linux. Happy to be here. Make oh, commentary nice, videos. Yeah. Thanks for having me. Beautiful. 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 <laughs> Thank you for coming on. I appreciate you for coming on. Guys, it's jokes. Lighting up you pieces of everybody's laughing at everything I'm saying. Okay. Man. To the right of Lyrics and below Fox Akimbo. Some ordinary gamers. I don't know why you have an S in the name. Uh, Hello, Indian. It's, it's a, <laughs> yeah, yeah. It's, uh, I'm, I'm Mudahar, okay? My name is Mudahar, okay? My channel is Some Ordinary Gamers what because I know? like to include people into the community. I like smoking crack cocaine and making videos in my oh, free time. Guy. That's what I do, ladies and gentlemen. Bam! There we go, Carantos. That's there we the go. Thank goodness. Okay, I don't know why you tried escaping me introducing you. It would have yeah. been fun. Guys, don't, don't do that. I enjoy these introductions. Below lyrics. To the left of two mad and diagonal to Muda and low. Turkey Tom, go ahead and introduce. Wait, yourself. you're not going to introduce yourself, Karantos? Yeah, because he was waiting for it. Nobody gives a fuck about the producer. Dude, nobody, nobody knows. This guy's got 200 followers on Twitter. Nobody knows this guy. Oh yeah, yeah. Fuck keep Destiny talking. Stop trying to gutter. stop trying to average that. It doesn't work. There's already an Ethiopian we white hip weirdo that does this. It's, it doesn't work. Go I'm ahead and introduce yourself. Go. Now, who are you, Karantos? My name is. I'm curious about that. My name is um, Mashali. I'm an incel content creator. You can find me at youtube.com slash Mashali, Mashali, Mashali Crack, Rack. Um, I make a lot of red pill content. I'm going on Fresh and Fit next week. Me and Sneeko have been hanging out a lot lately, so yeah, you can, you can check me out. Wait, is that true? No. Oh, yeah, brother, red <laughs> pill yeah, for what life, do you mean? dude. How's that? Wait, you're going to go on working out. He just went straight red pill. Yeah, I'm going on Fresh and Fit, dude. Just message uh, Myron. I don't, I don't believe you. You're a dumb man. I'm where, famous. Where is, like, where is? Are you really? Hold on. Your channel's like. Hey, dead. Don't you get like three thousand views a video? He just called I'm you, you anthrax. Anyway. You. Nice guys. Take it seriously. To the right of Tom and below Muda, we have the schizo poster himself. Whatever. Listen, just because, listen, I gained a bit of weight and everybody says that I'm too mad. I don't know why. We got too mad over here, <laughs> ladies and gentlemen. Go ahead and introduce yourself. You're fat, dude. I am too mad. I, I use, I'm really good at Twitter. I'm excellent at Twitter. I'm tremendous at Twitter. Extremely so. You get me. You understand. Mm. I'm black. I'm fat. I'm not fat anymore. Let's okay, see it. So. Come on. Let's hey, prove good. it too, mad. No. Let's oh, show the gut. Like... Show the gut. Take your shirt off. Take your shirt off. What the Oh right. man! All right, this is a lot on Twitch. I think this cool. is an improvement. <laughs> or kick. It's gotta be yeah. NSFW or something. Anyways, you know what? Too I mad. bet too mad. I bet too mad is more in shape than Carantos. Best, best. I, you yes, listen, yeah. If you're trying to get me to do the same thing, you couldn't pay me all the money in the world, nigga. Get the f out of here. It's not gonna happen. Yeah, because never. Yes, too mad. No, it's because again, I hide my face for the same reason. I don't show anything else. Too good looking. Below Turkey Tom. We have watch list. William McDonald. Go ahead and introduce yourself. Hello, hello. I make uh, red pill videos. Based, That's it. based. That ho. Based. <laughs> oh, I got. You uh, guys all suck, by the way. Anyways, <clears throat> let's get into the. Uh, let's get into the. Except low. Except low. I like bro, that. Destiny, where the f are you hiring these ISIS producers, bro? What the <laughs> Why the f are you talking? Yeah, it's a really about? professional hire. He can't even show his face. Yeah, dude. I swear I saw this. I don't even understand what the joke is. Yeah. ISIS had a ton of great video. The producers. joke is that we all saw this guy behead a journalist <laughs> last week on CNN. I'm just saying, this was like the most earning. I'm just saying, bro. All the videos went viral. All the videos went viral. Yeah, it's not like the guys making the ISIS videos are the ones doing the execution. Why would I not hire the talent? Come on, bro. That's true. That's Hiring out of country to pay lower wages. Classic destiny. Dude, okay, shut the destiny, fuck bro. up. Why the f are you talking like I'm some make a wish case? You half of you niggas look like yeah, you need me. to put on a mask. Now let me get on with the topic. <laughs> Damn. Thank you very much. <clears throat> okay, first of all, I assume that most of you guys are familiar with the Nick is not green since you know Muda wanted me to tease it. I want to get into it first, even though it wasn't the first question. 
Actually, mm -hmm. Lyrics, you did a video covering this. Like, it was like 35 minutes long or something. Yeah. To the best of your knowledge, could you take us through the Nick is not green situation? Um, so basically, Super Mega is like a comedy skit YouTube channel that recently got uh, falsely accused of covering up someone's who they were friends with in the past. And uh, to spare all the details, the Nick is not green thing is that he was friends with the person who allegedly got... He made a video... He made a video saying that all the allegations were absolute fact. He didn't say allegation once in the video. He took everything as bulletproof, like proof, as if it actually mm -hmm. happened. When in reality, I mean, it's just allegations at the end of the day with no proof and whatnot like that. So, I mean, he just falsely accused someone of... And Ooh. covering up... A... He accused... Uh, he called the guy blatantly in, in his video. So, I mean, yeah. Just blatant. I mean... Because... Oh, there's just like no evidence that? at all. There's just like no, no possible evidence, mm -hmm. Dude, no nothing, not even like quote, super circumstantial. A quote, literally from his video, is that of course I'm not going to question uh, oh, my shit. friend's word. So he's using mm -hmm. the thing of like saying that he's friends with the person, so he's going to go on his public platform of seven hundred thousand people to accuse someone of someone with no proof other than his, uh, his friend's testimony. Oh, so it's just shame. I mean, like. <laughs> Yeah, like, here's the thing. Here's the thing. If you're friends with someone, if your friend mm -hmm. goes to you and tells you, like, hey, I was by this guy. Yeah. Like, a normal friend would be like, oh, my God, that's horrible. Like, put, like, t like, I believe you. I just want to comfort you or something like that. You know what I mean? If you're friends with them behind closed doors. But if you have yeah. a 700K YouTube channel, you have a responsibility to not just platform your friend's blatant allegations with no proof at all. Because now you're jeopardizing other people's lives, you know? That's basically, so it, yeah. Dude, I hate Let researching me ask you guys. now, bro. Everyone else can just not research and, like, put out... Yeah, dude, it's so shameless. And he has the most popular video on the topic. You know what yeah. I mean? So he's like the same the shit. Most... Same bro. Harvard watched that shit anyway, so he's feeding them. He knows what they want, is what that is. He's like a special... Wait, hold on. Yeah, hold who's on, more Brandon. guilty, Brandon, Super Brandon. Mega or Two Mad? Wait, hold on, Willie oh. Mac. Brandon, didn't you, did you just say it's the same thing that they did with Two Mad? I was just... It is. It's similar. <laughs> oh man, Jesus! Yeah, can we, can we, can we, can we, I think we've also made a two oh, man video, so we can do a full deep deep dive here. I mean, I agree. I agree with two, Matt. He's like that video just seems like it's feeding retards. So you know, as yes. long as you feed like them, that. then you're good. Yeah, it's just it's like fourteen year olds. It's fourteen year old Twitter yeah. artists who have like never experienced it, any life experience it, like whatsoever. Yeah, it's like oh, T channel. It's like people don't care if things are right or wrong. They just want their biases to be recon like confirmed. I guess you know. Yeah. Yes, that's it's all. Masturbatory. Okay, let me ask you guys this question then. Do you feel like YouTube should, you know, hold creators like Nick is not green accountable for making hit piece no, no, videos? No. That no, signal no. boost unverified no, allegations. No, Wait, you no, don't bro, YouTube, 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 you, YouTube needs to bring community notes onto the platform. We should all be allowed to make videos and respond and just, you know, that's like, not terrible. correct people. That'd be a good idea. But smart people already know what's going on. So it's just dumb. Oh, no, shut the. No, majority yeah, unfortunately, people aren't smart. no. Yeah. If smart people know the, what actually is going on here, I mean, that's one thing. But the majority of people aren't smart. I mean, everyone watching that video is just a dumb 14 year old. You know? That's so even though, up. so even, no, hold on. So even though Super Mega, like, they've come out saying that, guys, we might not be able to, you know, continue content creation, da 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 da. Even though his actions could lead to a channel like Super Mega's. To stop creating content, you don't believe that YouTube should step in because, again, like no. with the EDP situation, for instance, right? Uh -huh. you, wait, hold on. Like, let's talk about it, right? With the EDP situation, YouTube took him down even though there wasn't any legal proceedings. Nobody came out. It happened off platform. Like, it's not back. No, by, it's not know. the similar situation. Yeah, but EDP yeah, was like well, a. Oh, bro. Yeah. Yeah. EDP's problem is like ED YouTube kicked EDP not because of the allegation, because EDP could possibly potentially like offend or you know find minors on their platform. They, they proactively did it so that they didn't have to deal with this if it you know down the line. They just that's every platform right there. It's almost two separate scenarios. I mean, and what, what we've seen from YouTube is they're not gonna be consistent anyways, you know what I mean? Yeah, no, they're not gonna I be consistent. Being wrong and reporting cool. badly promoted. is not illegal. I think yeah. I think like Just platform isn't. moderation is a bad idea. I think one thing that's kind of like difficult to confront about stuff like this is that um, it's very easy to like write it off as like it's Twitter artists, it's fourteen year olds, and that is very funny, and I like that narrative. But mm -hmm. that's not real. 
In reality, I think it's just like, you know, you see this happen in every community. We've seen this. We had Slazo back in the day. We had Quite. Now we have this. These are different communities of people who experience this. Um, some of them are 14, but some of them are also adults. I think that, you know, the, the reality you have to accept is that people just want to believe a victim. They do. Um, and in that, you will have sort of a destruction of channels, and there will be like a viciousness to it as well because people think that's the right thing to do. They get catharsis out of that. But these are not necessarily children. These are like very average people. I think they're also people that we could reach and potentially talk to um, and convince mm -hmm. of the they're truth. Um, I don't think they're just stupid. I think they're they're uninformed. I think they haven't seen the situation personally where it flips. Too bad you're stupid. You came on my stream and, no, and, and incriminated yourself in a lawsuit. Shut the fuck up. Yeah. Okay. Shut the fuck up, you did fat. You did if you were smart, you go to the Jim, so shut up and let me finish. Holy, you're Jim. Wow. Wait, 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 wait. Host, 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 host. Dude, dude, I love Jim Rat Tom, bro. He <laughs> just on. Yeah, on. yeah Tom, Tom, right Tom's new he's after he worked out. Dude. Tom's hey, roid rage is wild. Let, let me throw. Let me throw a question. Also, <laughs> stop, bro. I'm gonna mute you. Okay, this is my goddamn show. All right, me and Q. Okay, here's a question. I was about to say, I thought it was. Let me toss. No, Q. Okay, just kind of let me go. Let me throw a. Let me throw a question here. Okay, do you think that Super Mega? I'm going to victim blame a little bit. Do they have any responsibility for fostering yes. a fan base of people that are this sensitive to these types of issues? Yes. Well, Don't I, they just play I video games? That, it's I not that, even that, though. I, don't really I think, I think that. it is that. I think that one thing when you're a content creator that I've noticed you have to be super careful on is uh, some things you do and say, well, implicitly, um, you know, not explicitly, implicitly, bring in groups of people that don't agree with you. And if you don't fight those people on the opinions they do have and confront them when you see it, then eventually you're going to deal with a bunch of idiots in your audience that are going to go for the throat in situations like this. And so with, with, and so with Super Mega, they pandered to this audience of like, you know, I'm not saying it's bad to be LGBT, but very like progressive, pro-LGBT. All the just falsely accused. That's what Tom's saying. That That is what I'm saying. But it's it's this subsect of trans, of, of like... Alphabet mob, it's, bro. It's, it's this subsect of like trans alphabet Twitter users, and we all know who they are. We've seen them exist. And I think that by pandering to yeah, the pronouns and, and pandering, buyers and pandering all that. to the believe all victims crowd, I think they they unfortunately caught themselves in the crossfire. Now, is it totally their fault? Did they probably know what they were doing the whole time? Probably not. But there probably were points along the way, I, I think, Destiny, to answer your question, where they probably could have looked back and been like, do we really want to get this audience of people? And they were like, well, it's never going to go wrong, right? And then it did. I think it's just crazy. If you get they're falsely they're accused, bro, uh, hold on. If you get falsely accused by somebody that works for you, you're always going to get absolutely. You're, you're, well, okay, but when are. it comes not, about working for you, absolutely though, absolutely not true. That is absolutely not true. Different communities who, will absolutely respond in different ways. To Tom, if your girlfriend turned around and was like, "Tom, me," and then your best friend made a video about how you did it, you would get destroyed at, at no, least I at the not. beginning. No, I absolutely. No, I no, because I have set a precedent on all of my channels of waiting for proper evidence to come out. I've never believed both women. sides. I have I have consistently said believe women with caution. With caution. Wait for your seats. Okay? And that's <laughs> always what I've said. Yeah, and that is exactly what happened. That's exactly what happened. Yeah. what happened. I'm fully confident. I'm, and this is why I constantly wrestle my audience about shit like this in, in chat and even in know, videos. Can we also say can, yeah, can I, we wait, also wait, say it's like them running their business like children too yeah. like it's yeah. like if you if you own like an office like we like i have my office i'm never gonna let friends or like co-workers just stay at my office for free yeah. like bro at some point you got to be like a mature adult and say listen go get a house go go do something else go go you, there, there's a time for place and work like, like a time for like you know just yeah. us being friends I and being professional right. yeah and there was a point when they did do that and then right. she made this video months later where she said that they covered up her so that's what they got for kicking her out of that one. But then know? the other, then the well, other one just... was wasn't it wasn't like um somebody had like a whole allegation of like I guess one of the employees after he got fired came out and was like oh yeah they also harassed me because I was gay and then now yeah, there's text messages just... actually so, on. That guy so then but like so <laughs> I I agree like but there's like if, when you sit here and treat employees I understand like people have like friendships with the people they employ so that's fine but when you sit here and treat them as if like their children are everything buddy buddy and there's no like, like real understanding. Of the lines of like what's acceptable and what's not, and now you're like crossing lines. Then you just set yourself up for like they just they even just, if you have irrefutable evidence. They just tried to be like frat boys of a whole bunch of yeah. non-binary like only fan tours. You know what I mean? That was where they went wrong. Good. When you yeah. when you get canceled, you find out who's good and stays. Everybody who's stupid, they can think what they want. It's good for them. Yeah, but going back, I've heard this take float around. I've heard this take float around of that they're culpable for pandering to this audience. But what I don't, I don't know what they've did to pander to this audience. Like I've heard people say that, by, but how by have they pandered? Bitches. By being little bitches, they're making cringe content of sitting down. On the they couch fought at creators. But to my knowledge, they topics about topics.
I'd oh, say, like, well, asked, probably asked, um, asked, making really sh music and, like, dressing like a little girl probably is oh, Matt Watson's dude, crime. On, he, he accumulated... But, all right, what, what audience did two men, what do you do the two though, men that cultivate that though? You know, like, I, that's what I was getting. An audience of, uh, yeah, it's like... Yeah, there's like a lot of problems. Like, obviously, the audience that they build, this like super hyper lefty mega progressive audience. I don't even it's think the that's the like worst part, part, right? Like, but, I don't, I don't think that's the worst part. I don't think, I don't think that's what ever going to be the worst part. Yeah, it's definitely part. not the worst part. But I don't even know what they mm -hmm. did to cultivate to that audience. Like, I don't know. I, 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 yeah, it's like did they, they, they just make like friendly content or something? Like content that's like a little more research. I've never seen anyone give an example of how they just I'll just drop this in that when I saw like me and a couple other people respond to what was going on, I wasn't injecting, I don't think, very much politics into the take or whatever. I was just like, this seems really insane. There's no evidence, blah, blah, blah. And when my stuff started getting posted in their subreddit, all the top comments were like, isn't Destiny and why are we taking this guy seriously at all? Like, doesn't this guy hate black people? Like, and it's like, why the f did you that? No, it's like, undoubtedly. Yeah, so I don't know what they did, but it seemed like they'd fought. Yeah, no, it's very, undoubtedly like, true. I think, I think it's true. Yeah. It is true. I think it's an audience of people that just like literally are okay with getting like third hand accounts. Like, it's like the destiny is an argument. I've heard that a million times. And like, there's just like, it's people that like have heard something from like two, three people, like this long game of telephone and oh. they refuse to actually go and see the source of any material or like come to their own conclusion now that's the kind of audience you foster walk, like, they like to go to the store and they like to have people see them that's what they like they like walking on the street and wearing here's the most bright colors here's the main thing super mega is culpable for for the biggest f they did is in their oh, response that? video uh the matt response video they completely mm -hmm. threw don who was the guy who was uh with i mean accused of with no evidence, they threw him completely under the bus. They completely co uh, agreed with Lex saying, we're sorry that he's you. We apologize for that. We believed you. When they were the ones getting falsely accused, they then threw another guy I under the bus. I think they have to take that L though, because they, just, they don't know personally optically, what happened. but that's not good ethically, you know? I mean, optically and ethically, like they just have to take that L because let's say Lex is telling the truth, right? There's no proof either mm -hmm. way. If Lex is telling the truth and that completely I mean, sorry to use the word, rapes them in the long run if they then Whoa. claim that she's falsely accusing, right? That's a horrible idea. No, don't get me wrong. It's good PR. It's the best PR they could have done. I mean, mm -hmm. that was the best uh, route they could have went in that response video. But that doesn't Is make there any right. chance I mean, that, that guys yeah, actually that would be the number one example. That would be the number one example of them pandering to that audience because they yeah. absolutely believe someone and accuse someone of without any proof i just think i feel like they have to do that like i don't think they would have won if they did that i, don't I mean yeah any other i mean you're right but that's pr at the end of the day it's not like so there were so there's good. more because uh, i thought the allegation yeah, was, was the guy like, guilty somebody yeah i thought there's no proof either way there's no there's no proof he, yeah. he gave his testimony which was a completely different story of events which was not and lex gave her who was accusing him lex gave her account and it was debatably but there's no proof either way let, let, oh, so I want to be throw be one guy under the bus is just absurd. Well, here's the same thing. When she was here's like, getting, she was getting head, she was getting head, and then like he said, well, she was giving head, Something and then like he put the head on like the like I, he, I got forced down, and it was like, oh, I have to grip on, and then the on. and then he claimed that like I, I did do that, but after that we stopped and I apologized and we just did something else for the rest of the night. So it sounds, from my understanding, is more of a bad experience rather than it was an awkward. Experience. Yeah. Can we like? Can we like re reproach again? All because all I don't know what horrible, topic anymore horrible. is. All these arguments are. Like, there's like, there's like, there's like three or four yeah. different things that happen. The main, the main problem with discounting Lexus is it very well could have happened. We have, we literally have no idea what happened there. We know her story sure. from, from her story. She feels she was from his. He feels he didn't. Yeah. Her, but yeah. he opens up by apologizing to her. Which honestly, does that mean he's guilty? No. But I feel like if I felt like I was falsely being accused, of, I'd be angry exactly. and livid and he came right yeah, out with an admission how many times oh, have yeah. we seen someone respond poorly to being yeah. that's true oh, that's yeah. true yeah. but 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 i'm not done i'm her. not done there's we, we have no evidence of what oh. happened in that room and my other thing with this um is evidence. like let's say let's say she did get right there's often like no proof for a what happens inside of a bedroom okay there's there, there's there's literally none like if she's supposed to like have predicted she would be a and then just recorded it all like like what is the standard she of proof we're asking for so i understand i understand like you know her feelings she got and i think that that's not even a hill that anyone should should die on argumentatively i think there are wait, didn't, I, she, didn't she date the guy for a year after wait, it happened though, wait too. i don't think it was no -uh. 
No. I would be it would crazy. Be made them after <laughs> multiple months. No, but it was like six months or so. It was like six the same, months or so. The same she, dated, she dated him at all. Bro, is it, see, this is the thing. We gotta actually have like a timeline for this. Like we're talking about like all this stuff. Wait, 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 wait. wait, wait. Yeah. Tom, let, let Tom finish. What is Tom saying? Because mm -hmm. that's complete. I mean, what are we supposed he, to do he though? He shouldn't have posted that. Shit what we're supposed to do, I think, I think is just like. He wants clout. Not not what die on that hill. Do you know? I like... think you have to run over that hill, and I think to to win to win this, you can question other things from a narrative, right? If you want to talk argumentatively, there's so much in that video for us already outside of the. We have no idea what happened in that. Room, okay, okay, right? okay, okay, okay. They're the, the only people. The that hill know. to die on. The hill to die on is saying we don't know what happened, so let's not ruin each person's party's life over something we can't even prove. But that's that's the hill yeah, to die on. Isn't it just like when like this happens, super serious stuff? Just. Wait for it. Just wait for both. Like, if yeah. you can't prove, well. if you can't prove if it happened, okay, instead of just throwing allegations out there willy nilly, okay, let's try to bet that, that first. That's all. That's all it comes exactly. down to. Because I, and I, if we have no proof, yeah. then how are we going to accuse I agree we should wait and we really should, we should ruin really her important. life. But it's I don't really want to accuse Lex of lying on that particular point. I don't want to. That's I don't think, I don't think, I don't think anybody's saying this. Wait, 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 wait. We're at the end of round one. Okay. Chill. Okay. We've got straw polls in chat. People vote to keep. Not kick. And okay, now, at the end of round one, Turkey Tom, just because you're blabbering so much, okay? <laughs> True. You well, yeah, are the point. winner. You are the winner. Yeah, you are the winner of round one. But now you have to make, okay? Uh -oh. The strongest of talkers have to have the hardest of wills to make the, the toughest decisions. You have to choose to kick either Ooh. Willie Mack or Fox Akimbo. Good luck. Oh, no. Ooh. Oh, wow. Um, I feel like, okay. Can I explain my reasoning, or do I have to just give them a decision? You can do whatever you want. Explain away. Okay, Go for yeah, it. Here's do my it. reasoning. First round, I know I talked a lot. I talked over people. I interrupted a lot. I'm going to work on that. Okay, I'm working on myself. I have a lot of narcissistic tendencies. I'm, you know, I'm just like a girl. I'm traveling around. I'm working on myself, doing heroin, stuff like that. But I think that I'm going to have to kick Fox at Kimbo because he didn't really talk. Even though yeah, I really like uh, him and I love his hair, <laughs> it's fire. You dressed Thank up you for very this. Much. Thank you very much. Thank you. I'll be honest. I really didn't know about this entire situation so it did kind of feel a bit for me to kind of Just weigh stand. in if i really don't know anything um but that's completely fine thank you very much for for having me guys it's it's really been a uh, a treat just to be able just to uh, for not talking out of his Right, bro. I mean, yeah, you had to we're all doing here wait hold on guys 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 let him shout himself out shout uh, out yeah i mean it's past my bedtime so i got to okay. Oh man! You um, show us your dick, bro. My name is Fox Akimbo. I'm on YouTube. Look me up. Um, yeah, I mean that's space. I'm on Instagram, Twitter as well at Fox Akimbo. Everything Fox Akimbo. F O X A K I M B O. Thank you very much, guys. It's been a pleasure. Uh, thank okay, God. Just kick it, hey, European. Hey, USA, USA. Okay. Finally, everyone hears from Holy. the continent now. Get the euros out of here. <laughs> Just like wait, wasn't he Australian? Anyways, wait, I forgot. Anyways, guys, congratulations for making it to round two. Wow, ninety nine percent of people do so. How many? There's a person that keeps disconnecting. Did I just hear that? By the way, it's Willie Mac. Somebody disconnect. Yeah, somebody. Willie Mac went out for a minute. Yeah. Exited. Okay. 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 Here's my next topic. Okay, and Mura, you could weigh in on this one because it's one that you actually covered, and I'm interested in all of you guys' take. It's about oh, the yeah. YouTube DMCA system and what they've been doing with a creator that goes by the name of Vince Vintage. Now, I don't think a lot of you guys are familiar with this situation. So, you know what? Just like last round when we went to Lyrics, uh, Muda, could you give us a brief okay. synopsis? So, basically what's been going on is a YouTuber known as Vince Vintage has basically been targeted for a month by a person abusing the DMCA system. He made a video about uh, an Xbox hack, and he covered this, you know, a uh, hacker that hacked the government and whatnot. So shortly after he made the video, the video gets taken down by the DMCA system, and the DMCA, like you can check, you can check who emails, like you know what the name and the email and like you know what the claim is. It was an email from like Proton Mail, which is like a dark web, uh, secure, uh, privacy focused email service. Anyways, his video was taken down, and he was basically in this like Twitter spat with this like douchebag hacker that claimed to not do it, but obviously, you know, playing a little bit dumb. Anyways, he uh, was getting stalked, ended up hiring a legal team, private investigation firm, and the problem has exacerbated to the point where this uh, guy 
uh, where like multiple copyright strikes are now being issued to his channel to the point where if you're over three strikes on your channel, period, you're entering like a termination phase. So that's pretty much what it comes down to. And um, that's just, uh, that's where it is. Um, that's all. That, that's Do we know anything? Of- it's finally stepping in. Hmm? Is there any debate? Do we know anything about the hacker? That's good. Not uh, really. Well, this is something that like uh, Vince has got through his PI. Uh, I know that YouTube's doing stuff behind the scenes. I don't know how much of the liberty I'm able to discuss, um, so we're just going to leave it at that. You yeah, just got that secret info. info. I mean, it's it's one thing that I was working with him behind the scenes. I mean, I think we could talk about like just from his video, like the reason the hacker went after him. Do we go into that at all? Well, the hacker went after him because basically what Will, uh, what um, what uh, Vince. Vince was doing was he asked him for an interview, and Vince, when he asked him for an interview, the guy was like, "I'm not going to give one to you, even though that I was already on podcasts." And uh, anyways, he told him like pretty much let the story die. Vince was like, "All right, f- it. I'm not going to get an interview, but I'm still going to make the video." He makes the video. The guy gets pissed at his portrayal of him, and this whole DMCA situation starts. Uh, Vince kind of put the f- bullet on his back or the bullseye on his back. Anyways. Mm-hmm. How kind of situation? Happened. Well, just by just by getting his you attention and talking to him, even though this yeah. topic was this covered guy, extensive. To, to give a little, to, to give a little more context, yeah. this guy is like an old head Xbox hacker who got busted and went to yes. jail. He was arrested by the FBI mm-hmm. back in the day. He went to jail, gets out. Welcome. Now, a lot of people like to make videos about these guys because it's really interesting to hear about you know Anonymous and Lizard Squad and these these hacker groups that you know hack PlayStation or Xbox and go to jail. So this guy, this guy goes to jail, gets out. A bunch of people make videos about him. Um, Vince decides to do a video. He decides to reach out to one of the people involved, who's this hacker. The hacker is like, no, I'd rather you just not make the video. And Vince is like, okay, well, I'm just going to make it anyway. So he makes it, and now this hacker's been relentlessly harassing him. Um, Yeah, yeah, so I see. So he kind of... This hacker has copyright struck, um, or not struck, he's... he's Allegedly, allegedly. Okay, this hacker has allegedly DMCA takedown 12 of his videos, I believe, or 5 to 12 of his videos. Um, His channel is at risk of termination very soon. Um, YouTube has not done much about it. Um, yeah. Are we debating? I mean, what are we, what are we? So yeah, we're getting a new the biggest, 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 the biggest culture that YouTube has created is that you have to whine and on Twitter to get anything done, which is, that, that's like the worst. I blame right? destiny for this. They're, they're as far as I know, that. as far as I know, the big picture issue with this is not just YouTube. It's copyright law itself. Cause I believe YouTube technically, and now they do mediate sometimes. Um, but technically YouTube is not supposed to mediate copyright disputes. Copyright is a legal matter. If you DMCA someone's mm-hmm. YouTube, you, someone's YouTube video, um, that is a legal proceeding. It is not like a YouTube proceeding. So people complaining about the DMCA system, I, I understand it, but I think a lot of that comes down to copyright law. As far as submitting your email or contact info that's also part of copyright law as far as i know you have to submit your information in some way now Uh, i I just feel like the easiest way to solve this is like just when you're filing a dmca claim and you claim to be like somebody like you know whatever your name is provide a government issued id or a passport or something that proves you're that or you just dispute it though and he's he's good no but if you if you if you dispute dispute it it. you give up if you dispute it you give up all your information but they're not really giving up theirs. so if you're going to file a claim prove that you're from somebody like to more like if i made a video about like starfield and like somebody was like i'm from zenimax legal youtube's just going to be like all right uh, throw him to the dogs now i I mean mean, surely this guy already knows his info right I don't think he's Yeah, dead. but I mean like I but when you're dead. filing a claim, you can just pretend to be somebody. So the whole like t- like Starfield for instance, if somebody pretended to be from the legal team of like Take 2, like the parent company, they're not proving that they're this person. YouTube just taking your video down. So I feel like if you're going to do that, provide a driver's license, a f- official letterhead, some like real piece of documentation yeah. that it, YouTube it, can look yeah. before they send yeah, that through. That would be nice. For the bigger make, picture. And I and I understand for the, like, bigger, the frustration with like YouTube like not responding, but I think that Moody you mm-hmm. probably agree with this like they just don't want to mediate copyright disputes because then that gets them into hot water with you know these past cases. Like that gets Viacom. that gets them into that gets them into trouble with the safe harbor stuff. They yeah. don't want to be mediating this shit at they, all. So They're they just like, hey, they, look, we're like, I understand the frustration and like I get it, but like big picture, I don't necessarily blame YouTube that much because it's like just it's totally, you know, it's not really in their hands. So if they, but if if go ahead, go go ahead, go because I just got like a, a massive question. Do we know what would have to change big picture about the copyright to be able to change this with YouTube? Uh, Do you know that? Um, no? Honestly, I it's think it's mostly like a. It's it's probably just like a YouTube laws. Form issue. We could determine something better right now. There would that have feels to be like a pipe like, like, that would be, if that big thing would change is insane to think. There would have know? to be like an insanely high, not insanely high. There would have to be a much higher standard than there currently is in order to get like a DMCA, like a video DMCA. So like, let's say we'd had like some government official reviewing each DMCA claim, which I mean, there would be a whole new 
uh, branch of the government, a new three-letter agency dedicated to just that because of how many copyrights. And we're lobbyists. There are. So, so we then, what what is the difference between like them getting involved or not getting involved this time, but like maybe like a year ago when Fresh and Fit was just going around just handling like copyright strikes and DMCA to a whole bunch of channels, but then YouTube then got involved in that regard. So, never so, clear. so occasionally, if you raise enough public Alpha. pressure, YouTube will get involved, but it, because, okay. they're, because they're getting and they're seen as the bad guys, but they will absolutely wait until the last possible moment to get involved because they don't want to be seen as copyright mediators. Um, this is something I've experienced that... with videos being taken down when it's clearly a false claim. They like, they're just, they, they, they don't want to get their hands dirty at all. They don't. No, the, for sure. The nuclear, the nuclear horrible situation from a legal point of view is YouTube mediates. Let's say somebody files a rightful DMCA claim, they are the copyright holder, and then YouTube mediates. Like, actually, we don't think you are for whatever reason, and it turns out that person is. Now, YouTube, who due to DMCA safe harbor provisions doesn't have any culpability or liability, now they're on the hook potentially for yeah. uh, copyright claims, which is a nightmare scenario. Like, that's why the, remo the removal of safe harbor is the destruction of anybody that uh, has user generated content because now they can be held liable potentially for any copyright infringing material on the platform. That's why they yeah. don't want to mediate yeah. it. Because in the cases like Viacom, Viacom tried to legally hold them responsible for content that was on their platform, like re-uploaded SpongeBob episodes, right? YouTube's such a mm -hmm. big platform. You can't expect them to be responsible for some dumb uploading SpongeBob on their website. It's so big. That's why Content ID was created to bots, to create bots to identify that content and take it down for copyright holders. But the issue with that is at the end of the line is just, it's just like horrible big picture for the internet, you know? But I, I okay, hold like on. Let me ask you guys a question. Hold on. Let me ask you guys. A, is if you don't think that YouTube is at fault for like the abuse that happens with their DMCA system, who is? I think they are at fault though. Like the like guy who's being screwed. Oh, the guy that that too, but, no, they're that's they're they're they're, they're partially at fault for again like the. Right. The level of like information and standard for what it should take to actually file one should be increased, like in insurmountably higher than where it's at right now. People can just like sit there and just do what they want to do and then just file it. They should at bare minimum. There should be a requirement of like things that make sense to do it. Again, I'm just going off of what I, I dealt with with Fresh and Fit. Fresh and Fit was like give, handing out copyright shame. strikes. Yeah, they were doing things and like even the the timestamps that they were giving were all out of order. If you just checked it, like you can clearly see like they'll say, oh, between the fifth. 15 minute mark and the two minute mark like had it backwards because they were bro, just filing bro, shit I, for it was like, true, but they just explained bullshit. why it has to be that way because then if youtube gets involved and they're wrong then they're liable yeah. um, no 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 but, 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 but what, what i'm dies, saying bro. is what i'm saying is the people themselves should there should be a under like a bare minimum standard if i'm going to file one there should be like information that should be filed correctly at bare minimum, but we're not even at that point. Like, I can, I, I, I can file is, anything I want to. The, I, the only way is, to. If I just clarify real quick, there is a bare minimum. The bare minimum is that you actually sign a legal uh, an affidavit well, swearing yeah. that that is your information. So that's not enough, though. Okay. But that's, the, that's only, the only the only way that I think this could be even reasonably handled is if like the U.S. government makes like a web portal where like you go into their website you like say hey this is the website where my offending content is located like youtube.com this is the url this is like my video and then you prove to the u.s government that you're actually that person and then the u.s government just sends a confirmation letter to youtube youtube then takes it down that's how you i think may, you may know done. the answer to this question is the identification standard provided by youtube or by the government i assume it's by the government and youtube just complies with whatever that standard is but i don't know I, I think the way that YouTube's DMCA stuff works is like, uh, are you talking about like when you get taken down and then you're counterclaiming? I'm just talking about like, let's say I, as a copyright abuser, want to go take okay. down the Mudahar video, okay? Um, the, okay. I, the standard is like, you need an email, you need a signed document, you need an explanation, right? Is that standard created by the US government in Congress or is that created by YouTube themselves? Like, I believe that's that created by the US government because what you're okay. just doing on YouTube is like auto-filling a dmca form exactly. and that just gets sense to so them. i think there would have to be some kind of legislation around this like we would have mm -hmm. to like fundraise you know 20 bajillion dollars to get this done which nobody's gonna obvious do. yeah nobody's supposed to do that yeah. i just think i i Biden. yeah i don't i don't think anybody disagrees i just feel we like we all agree it's whatever it's, yeah yeah I just guy, feel like it, there, there should be a different standard. There should be a, a Dude, and with Fresh deal. and Fit, and with Fresh and Fit, they were crying about getting demonetized from YouTube. Dude, they should be deplatformed considering the shit they're doing. I don't know, no. but considering that Never they're deplatformed. Deplatformed. that's a much better topic. No, 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 no. no, no. I'm not saying that. Hold on, hold on. I'm not saying that. Dude, I don't think they're we trying should to get other people retards. deplatformed. Wait, 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 wait. They're okay. trying to get deplatformed. We need these. So how do they make they videos? Absolutely man. deserve it though. There would be no sympathy. Okay, wait, wait, Larix, Larix. Let me ask you this. So when it came to Nick, is not when it came to Nick, right? I think one of you guys said you can't deplatform somebody for bad journalism or for like reporting on a story badly, even though he himself mm -hmm. came out and said 
hey, this is my friend. This is not like something where I take both sides into account. I'll just believe my friend. And they were yeah. celebrating the fact that Super Mega were losing subscribers, right? But in this instance, you guys are like, no, you shouldn't deplatform them, even though they're pretty much doing the exact same thing. It's so not the exact same. Why thing. the double it's standard? It's not the exact same thing because one of them is defamation, wait, wait, wait. which is not which is not a criminal standard. It's a civil standard, and the other one is um, in regards to copyright takedowns, which is clearly a criminal standard because copyright. Wait, wait, hold on, hold on. Copyright infringement isn't that? that isn't, are they civil? Uh, I don't think like copyright infringement. Okay, I'm talking about ass a little bit. Copyright infringement I'm talking about ass a little bit. Criminal. Big picture, big picture. My big problem with Fresh and Fit is oh, why I. Why? Shut up! Shut up! I'm moving on. I'm moving on. I'm moving on. Shut up! Okay, okay. Big, big picture problem with Fresh and Fit, and why I wouldn't feel that bad if they get deplatformed is they actively pose a direct threat to the content creator ecosystem by doing things like DMCAing people falsely and abusing copyright law. Now, if Nick is not green got deplatformed would i feel bad for him probably not considering he consistently advocates for deplatforming of other people would i advocate for him to be deleted off youtube no would i be okay if fresh and fit did would i you know laugh and you know spark up a siggy for that yes I they would. deserve it <laughs> they deserve yeah, bro, it they're, I, trying, to that, other, that, they're trying to get other people no I, th I think that's reasons. a i think that's like the best know. like point it's like if somebody is like abusing or somebody's like trying to get other people taken down or is using like dmcas falsely yeah bro they should get the uh, they should get deleted I mean, off the platform. I mean, dude, how many times can you Russian be wrong bitch. though? Because they did it like ten times or whatever it was, or it was like only it was three times that I've been preached, right? And then uh, to one other person, you, you must, you must not and then they didn't what's do going it again. On. So how many times could no, you be no, wrong? No, no, on no, no, copyright? no, stop, stop, stop. Wait, they they, they, they on, did it. To, they did it to several channels, and mm -hmm. through several channels, they gave multiple um, copyright strikes to, and they did it incorrectly. Everybody knew that they no, did it. Right. How, I'm they asking, how many times can you file a false copyright strike and be like, keep your channel? Well, they did it at bare minimum like 25 different times. So I don't know like how often they did it, but they YouTube definitely exceeded that threshold. You get 11 false copyright strikes. So we, should, like, we should just enact Sharia law for the people that are like committing like, this problem. It's like the platform. difference between, the main difference between Nick's and Not Green is that he made a video saying his fans should go and report Sneeko. That's one thing, you know, but at the end of the day, Fresh and Fit on air said that just because people were talking about them or defaming them, they abused the copyright yes. system to try to get their videos taken down, which is a completely separate other issue. If you have an issue of copyright versus defamation, I mean, you can't use the copyright system to try to get If you have a copyright open... problem, if there's a legitimate copyright issue on YouTube and you're DMCAing yes. somebody, that's okay, all right? Like, if somebody's stealing your shit, exactly. uploading yeah. it, delete it. But if you can't handle a bit of criticism and you're DMCAing because of that, then YouTube literally says in their DMCA form, that is against the rules. Dude, even, even if it's... Where are the punishments? Where's dude, the removal? Wait, hold on. Wait, 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 Okay, He's so be on probation. what do you think? Okay, do you think do you think that that was deserved, or do you think like that was okay on YouTube's part probation. to do so? Because they didn't well, even give them an answer. Yeah, they I think they should go. They, uh, they need to give them an answer. They need to give them an answer. Yeah, they, Wait, they hold on, hold on. Let go. Let go. Oh, I want to say, yeah, they they need to give them an answer to why they did it. How, and I think that that right there is the most reasonable thing to do. If they believe that they don't want to give them an answer because they're trying to hide their hands and make sure, like, a, um, I don't want something to sound contradictory or anything like that, they need to give them an answer. That's fine. However, the reason why I still really don't give a f because they've done multiple things that should have got them their monetization taken away anyway. They've done several things that have completely like what? disregarded. Like what do you um, think like was enough? Everything, Wait, every uh, every everything from um, brandishing uh, firearm on stream, Ace. making fun of, not even making fun of like remarks and stuff like that. But, um, being yeah, able what, to what say? What say? What wait, say? wait, wait. Okay, low, low. You're wait. you're attacking it from the wrong angle. Wait, 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 okay, here, 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 here. It's oh, too right, inconsistent. Even... Just stick to the DMCA. If they're trying to use the but that, but that, to get but other that... people taken down, that's the bullet point. Uh, are but that's I'm happened talking the about year things before. that they've done. So the year, oh, the year before. Wait, so you don't think you know why they got monetized? You don't know, but like, okay, 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 right okay. Now. We gotta, we gotta be hard edged on what is like enough to get removed from the partner program. You said brandishing like, firearms. Do you think actually, brandishing firearms is bad? Like that thing. I, think if I don't think there's anything if you're wrong. Pulling with that. it out. No. They, they, let me be clear. They also didn't do. They had somebody else on there, so I can see why that would be a little bit. Which call? Yeah. But what yeah. I'm saying is, uh, I agree with what yeah, Nick like, Fuentes probably did. Lyrics. <laughs> Realistically. No, actually was, what's the black guy's name? It was somebody else. Ly but lyrics oh, were the, like, black dude. 
You can have uh, No, not even him, but that is Jesse White other, or whatever other, his name other, is, right? Other, yeah, Charles, Charles White. White. That guy's literally Charles a rapist. White. No, no, not 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 that black. But yeah, like like Larry says, like doing I what they did you. last e last year, that alone should have got them kicked the f out of here. Like just sitting here purposely, and they knew that they were abusing it. That alone should have got them the f out of here. Because what did they do last like, year specifically? Like what that is the the, um, the, the copyright. The the copyright. I think, I think exactly. Okay, yeah, that should get up. Yeah, that, that should have that should have packed them even, up. Even easily. even if you want to go after Fresh and Fit for that, you'll never find a clip of Fresh and Fit saying we abuse the DMCA system. Tim Pool asked them and they say, You will. On, the, on no, Tim no, Pool, no, they no, literally no, said no, that. No, 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 no. Shut the f up. Let me say, say that. Let me, it, let me say this. They yeah. did not verbatim say they I do. abused it. No, that's not what they said. What they said is, you know, we took that's the legal matters. You know, we took the DMCA matters. It's all resolved now. You're never going to hear them say, I abuse it. And so from YouTube's perspective. No, no. This is what they said, Tom. They said, No, people were talking about us. They said, yeah. People were talking about us. So we decided to go ahead and hit them with DMCA strikes. Yes. And Tim, because they were talking to Right, and that's, that that's, wait, 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 that's, not, that's not that's not YouTube. YouTube is not a judge. YouTube is not in a court of law. YouTube is just a platform they post to. And so I agree. I wouldn't feel bad if Fresh and Fit got deplatformed. Okay? Why do they even have a terms of service around it, Tom? I don't give a shit about the terms of service. Okay, they're what if they, what if they felt what? like they were the what if they felt like they were what? talking. But they legitimately felt like they were also violating copyright. Yes, what if they both and, 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 but that problem wasn't, I'm going to say, the problem is that when they were handing out the reasonings, that wasn't the reasoning. The reasoning was just simply because they were, they felt as if like we were talking shit. People about were talking. That was, that was their reason. They never, they never they actually, actually gave a, 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 a reason. No, 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 no. I'm, not, I'm, not, I'm not saying YouTube gave us, we're talking about when they filled it out, when I, when we received their lawyer's information or their, whoever the, the whoever There was no lawyer ever. Yeah, yeah. Whoever that, whoever that was that was sending out information, when we were sent, we received it, it was mm -hmm. not some like, hey, between this timestamp and that timestamp, you all use no, nothing but our inf No, it wasn't that. That's not what they did because even if they had that provided that, even if they had provided that, well, A, they couldn't because when they were sending out timestamps to some people, they had the timestamps all out of order and even in the timestamps people's what you call it yeah pe people weren't even um the, there wasn't even their film their video in the timestamps they were just making up on the fly when you are doing that when you are purposely abusing it you're purposely doing it wrong you purposely know what the f you're doing because they you waited on it. us they wait they waited on us to make three <laughs> videos specifically yeah. they had already handed out copyright strikes and then we finally made our third one because they wanted to remove us they were purposely doing that okay you got to get the f off the I, for that, I agree in a perfect you got to get the fuck out the i platform. agree in a perfect world but let's look at the doomsday scenario for this okay let's say uh, let's fuck. say Tom, let's say you are uploading, five let's boys. Say, let's let's say you are wrongfully uploading copyrighted content to YouTube, not like a reaction video. Let's say, for hypothetically, there's someone who's wrongfully uploading copyright content to YouTube. Let's say a rights holder decides to take that down, and then the person in question who's uploading it says, "Hey, um, this is actually my content. It's actually transformative, it's fair use. You need to put it back up." And then YouTube puts it back up because of public response. Not that's a back. completely different situation no! than he just let described. Let me though, answer. Bro. Let me answer. Let me. Answer. Let me answer. Shut the though. fuck up. You don't listen. You're from Chicago. You're ethnically. He's changed the whole scenario. But the reason I'm bringing up the really scenario is talking. because that is the flip side of this. That's what's going to happen if YouTube just starts cracking down. And then YouTube's going to be big, big one the of these. Flip. Because YouTube's entire copyright system is built around Safe Harbor and oh, undermining can Safe I, Harbor. Can I say something? His scenario, this guy's scenario, was that, uh, was that, was that, Fresh and you fit were getting completely wrong timestamps on on their uh, on their complaints to YouTube. Tom's like, scenario is people are just uploading other content. That's Bro, not my scenario. Follow, it's my scenario. scenario. It's that, not is not scenario. that is not my scenario. That is not my scenario. I'm not saying it's yeah, the same. Yeah. I'm saying the flip side and the ultimate ramification for YouTube if they start cracking down on this stuff is they are going to f up one case where a rights holder legally had a right to DMCA content. That's going to get taken down. They're going to get f for that, and then you, they're no, going to take. If the they're rights holder is anyone for making an argument, argument saying wrong, YouTube should come in. They're in place trouble here. with that. That's I don't. Making I, that honestly, I want I want hey, the, the smallest amount of YouTube intervention possible. The smallest. Yeah, I agree. I don't think anyone's making that argument. We're just there's saying there's no amount. sympathy if they get. I agree, there's no sympathy, but he's he's saying they yeah, should like, be banned. No, I'm saying he Tom said a whole Did new scenario. That, is what I'm that? saying. I'm not talking about you. I'm talking about you. I am. I am. I am. 
we're getting, you know, I am dude. undeniably saying that. Well, he's dude. undeniably saying that. They're getting, wait, 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 they're getting low, 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 banned low, low, low. for violating the rules, violating and doing false yeah. strikes. No Fill up the form wrong. Beyond no one's right? saying sympathy. No one's saying sympathy. He's no. saying if YouTube should come in low. Are you saying YouTube should come in here? I'm saying, I'm should saying if, if well, I'm saying YouTube the result, the result of where they at right now, which I don't, again, we don't know like why <laughs> they got demonetized. What I'm saying is if, if, because Mudahar asks, what did they do? The un, one undeniable thing that they did do was go completely against the term of service. No, no, no. We know that. I'm just asking. System. I'm just asking. Hey, simple, simple, simple. No, I'm. Uh, you I'm think not. YouTube should come in. Oh no, I'm not saying YouTube. Tell, I'm saying we they should, should be. But I'm not saying YouTube. No, no. YouTube okay, is okay. Retarded. I'm saying what they should though. Right. But YouTube in particular. And no, I just don't give a f about what they. With that amazing though. ending comment, we have come to the end of round two. Our votes have been in for a minute and a half, and now that was riveting. That was riveting. Turkey Tom. Oh. You've won a second time. However, you're not allowed to kick twice in a row on this show. Okay. So the second place winner, our good friend Mudahar, mm. who's popping Addies right now to hold on to Why the show. Wish. Congratulations. <laughs> Mudahar, the decision falls to you. You have to choose to remove one of two people. Either oh, man. Willie Mac or Lyrics. Good luck. Oh, f man, I love both these guys. Remember what did I do? Day, Remember, there's a prize at the end of $500 worth of gifted subs. So whoever you remove, you're actually pulling potential money from their pockets. Feel even worse about oh it. Oh my, you're going to make, you're going to put me on the streets. Mm. Where's the, where's the poll at? That's the or on Q. Chat. I put in my chat. kick chat. Okay. Yeah, both chat. Zoom call videos and you'll give viewers. Oh. I don't want to get rid of either of them, Jesus Christ. But I guess we're going to have to go with... Dude, come on, man. Dude, come on. Pull the trigger, buddy. No, don't kick lyrics. Oh, wow. Thanks, too, oh, Matt. Shit. I support your core case, buddy. <laughs> Yo, <laughs> video I'm going to have to keep Willie Mac in this because lyrics is probably going to be number one. For that you. reason, you're fired. Wow. 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 Damn. Yeah, like, Wait, I'm out of Willie Mac's out. To back elimination, no, champ. Lyrics, no, 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 no. lyrics, lyrics you, you're, you're out because you're, you're... What? No. Willie Mac, you gotta, you gotta head out for the night, bro. No, this is unbelievable. Yo, Muda, you are one. Don't Muda on your podcast. I'm sabotaging it. Dude, say all the demonetizable We're dropping all those slurs. All right, we're gonna. Willie Mac. Oh, damn, he didn't even. Hey, he didn't even shot himself out. Hey, everybody knows Willie, man. That's rough. That's rough. Well, Willie, thank you for coming on anyways. Guys, you know what? I want to switch gears. You know what I mean? Pause. I want to switch gears with you guys. Shout out LeVar. I have a question for you. <clears throat> if someone ruled out... Who, who just spoke when I was asking the question? You know the rocket like I, scene in, in the... the details, <laughs> they quote you around it. <laughs> <laughs> you got a question? Yeah. <laughs> Just fill them the okay, blank. okay. If someone ruled out dating a person because they're trans, is that transphobic? I'm just curious. No. This is. I'm just, just curious. I'm just curious. I'm just curious. Commentary okay, okay, panel okay. on you. Ask okay, that. wait. Hold yeah. on. Hold on. Shut the f up. It's not like you guys okay, were just I being think fucking very well. Like could be. We're all transphobic. transphobic. But is there anything wrong with that? Kill yourself. What do you mean? Transphobia? <laughs> it's a hot take, King. Wow. Well, the idea is like you don't want to exclude him. True. No, we're, this is not a real conversation. Dude, Matt, have you f***ed a girl with a penis? <laughs> All right, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I just, got, yes. I just got another question, okay? This, I want to know. Yeah, we got the commentary, guys. <laughs> I got a better question. Ready? Like a good you're topic. afraid. You're scared. You're running. You don't want to know the truth. No, you're being a by the way, because I wanted better... to build it to something else. Wait, hold well, on, Will Steve. I've got to wait. No, no, wait. This is important because I don't know if you'll be like Yes, no, no. Wait, hold on. No, no. I told you to do it. We'll get to it. We'll get to it. You cut the slicker yasso last time. Don't do this. Because you niggas said that it's nothing wrong with it, right? If you don't want to date a trans person, it's not like, it's like not you're transphobic. not transphobic. No. Okay, let me ask you this then, right? 10 times out of 10, you own a store. You get robbed by a black person. The 11th black person that comes through the door, you send somebody <laughs> after him. He didn't do anything. You just send somebody after him. Does that make you racist or are you just, you know... Recognizing patterns. I'm curious. Pattern recognition, my friend. Pattern, okay. man. Probability. It's, it's, why, it's why all like Bro, a you gotta of take products care are locked floor. under a oh, cage in um, certain Walmarts and certain neighborhoods. You know what I mean? Certain products get stolen and they're locked up for a reason. Dude, know? we all know the f 
Doesn't Ethereum make you racist. Is, you know, we know, we know what's up. You know. Wait, okay, so you're not racist. It's pattern recognition, 100%. You're not racist. I didn't say that, but I did it, say, correct? but I did say there's nothing wrong with it. I did. Say we need low to weigh in on this. Okay, Honestly, this is like something completely different, like different from it. what you're actually attracted to. If I'm not attracted to someone who's trans, then me not Dude, liking I'm not me. a chick with a dick. Okay? I'm not saying this, this, this is not happening. This is not because now, like I'm on my I'm on my fifth dick. I've and now all of a sudden I'm good with trans. It's not. That's not how this works. I'm just not attracted to trans. That's it. These are That's such it. like bullshit Wait, questions, Carantos. I feel these like are these are bullshit. such like no, it's not bullshit. Let no. Destiny take over. Yeah. This is a yeah, terrible question. Yeah. I'm, 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 I'm not taking over. I'm not taking over. I'm not taking over. I'm not taking over. Take over. No, no. Ask the question. Ask the question. Look at these snakes staring on you after you ask it. By the way, here's the question: Did two mad that girl? Yes. Oh no! Wait, two mad? Did you say yes to that? He said no. <laughs> Holy! No, he didn't. Oh, but what? Tell, tell us, Matt. Give your defense. defense. Give your yeah, defense. You, right you now. didn't. Remember, but what did you do? What did you do? I mean, to you be honest, too, Matt. Since you're here, you, you, know what I mean? like, you touched her. Honestly, you touched like, her. just give us a comment or two. I mean, I had you, a question about Tumat, but I was being tasteful. You know what I mean? I was being a piece of. Sh Anyways, too mad. Since bro, we just hire a like, hooker, bro. It's a lot easier, dude. Wait, wait, wait. Uh, yeah, Mudahar, there you go. Oh, what was, um, too mad? Can I ask? What was the girl wearing Guys, at the time? Guys, too fucking talking, but his mic is on one HP. Shut the fuck up and let him talk. Too mad, go ahead. There was a long pattern of manipulation from the beginning of the relationship where it was first. Hey, that's one. <clears throat> mm hmm. From who? You or the other party? Yeah, you're manipulating your wife. Yeah, this is like, not sounding good for me. That, that, that did not good. sound good. You need to talk to a lawyer cook. before you talk right oh, now. Oh, no. Let, let him cook. Let him cook. He already did it on Tom's stream. Yeah, let he's definitely cooking let already. Him let him go. Too mad. Yeah, I so definitely pressured that. her. Okay? That's him. Let him definitely. Yeah. And then, Say uh... It. She was very, like... She's, like, mentally ill. She has problems in her brain. <laughs> This is uh, not making you, it better, bro. Yeah. <laughs> Wait, so you manipulated, <laughs> I, I, you I, manipulated I, I, a mentally I, handicapped person? I, 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 I didn't rape her. She was, her. She was mentally with, handicapped. There was a lot of manipulation from a, a handicap. Come on, what are we doing right now? I about blacks because... No, but then I actually I locked her outside one time for fun. And then the next day... She sucked my ball. <laughs> too mad, too mad. Okay, major oh, question. It's I over. Put a lot of, get the lawyer. Get the lawyer. Please get the lawyer. Please get the lawyer. Okay, lawyer. no, it's not, no. it's not a big deal. It's not a big deal. I think I can be his lawyer. Too mad. There's oh, a lot of people in chat questioning. Okay. I also saw this cited in the lawsuit. Someone's asking, was she built for BBC? What the fuck? She was oh. built for BBC, boy. Okay. For BWC. <laughs> oh, okay. All right, well. Get it from the back and did Patrick Bateman pose. Yeah, okay, what's that this Patrick consensual. Bateman thing? Are you you were flexing in the mirror? <laughs> Man. Yeah, I was flexing in the mirror while I had consensual sex with her. Everyone which does she that. She claims is not consensual. After. Mm. Everyone does that. Did you do like I, uh I, did you do like this thing? Like that like that like, were you like, he went up, he like went up Yeah, top. like I'm like this. Mm -hmm. like, Dude, I'm just like saying that, buying right? hookers is a lot easier than you never have this issue, bro. No, I tried. Just pay and what is gone, what is the going price what for hookers tried? nowadays? What's the like whatever it is, it's less it's less than a like a Allegation. Allegation. Yeah. Yeah. Like two to $300 for a 30 minute uh, in call for like an out call, like 300 to 500 typically in an American yeah, city. You, but you uh, how did you that. fail? You how did you, how'd you fail too, man? Getting a hooker. Feel... Oh, say again? How'd you fail getting a hooker? Oh, I didn't fail. I tried it. Oh no, I've tried. It's just, it never works. Like I never enjoy it. Like it lasts like five seconds type. Are you consider you're not to a mistake? Yeah, you're, not, you're not that quick? Five oh, seconds? I don't know. I've never met with a woman before. What do you do? You're never a lawyer. Wow. So why, why does it last? So you, five so you nut with men? I, just, I, like, I put it in. Damn, I, nigga. Out, like, I don't want to do this anymore. Do you mad? Have you like rubbed your dick oh. raw from jerking off to porn? It's just like wait, wait, wait. paper on that. Yes, I have like scabs. And... Bro, no, you need to see. You need Tom, to see a Tom, medical Matt, professional. I've had it. Um, so two two men his two men's his career up because of this girl pressuring a girl to have sex with him, and he just said he's, he's never watching. nutted with a girl ever in his entire seems life. seems like it wasn't worth it. It seems like it wasn't worth it. Yeah, it just seems like these allegations yeah. that you brought onto yourself are just... I lit my like, dick on fire and it's stuck in inside. Wait. Hmm. What? Hmm. How old was the girl? I, like the other Asian chick, Kazumi. She was several years Wait. old. Yeah, did she have a driver's Wait. license or no? Wait, what? How old oh, was she? No. <laughs> oh, no. She was 18. Oh, 18 on you got birthday, right, the day I, of. I keep being on the dot. He got right there where he needs to be, 18.0001. Yes, absolutely. <laughs> keep in mind, commentary, guys, all right? If it comes out that Tim Ad was guilty, all you motherfuckers are going to be posting this exact video of the other commentary guys be. not saying anything in your oh, own commentary I video. You will, you will, you will, you will, you will,
Don't you say to the face. You just say don't to bait us up. and then get the out, you piece of shit. This isn't even your show, okay? You don't even do shit for this show. You just pay this like $10 an hour to run this shit. He doesn't even oh, have good okay, questions. Tom, he's, asking he's asking us if we should kill black people. He's asking us if we should kill black people and trans people. I can already see it in my mind. Turkey Tom spends more time angry at host of internet show than too mad. Nick, not I green spent video. five Ooh, hours the other night oh, interviewing this Nick, that stupid piece video. of shit <laughs> mother And by the way, by the way, if he loses in court, my live stream with him where he <laughs> says, I pressured her into is definitely going to be cited in the court case. So I don't like you say all that. Yes, he did say and that. And especially since he said it he twice He also now. showed us Man. a video. He showed us a video voluntarily where she's yeah. like trying to have like a nice conversation and like c like confront problems. He's like, okay, but what if you got naked right now? <laughs> like, Wait, you so you're mad? No, no, he's all, 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 he's all, yeah. So all Dude, seriousness, too mad. What, what, like you like, basically? Right ex no, what you explained today, like ten minutes ago, just right now, too mad was like you pressured a mentally handicapped girl, right? Bo Blacks. Young I just, I just even, even, that. even though you can't come, you still decided to do that. Or fun. Yes. Just <laughs> you, try, you, try, <laughs> this shit's a giggle, you tried to do the like the D twenty on the okay, I get it. I understand that. Just why? for the shits and giggles. Just for the shits and giggles. Too mad though? Like why? Experience. Well trying to have But you can't <laughs> not though. I don't get that. Why is that the go to option though? Why couldn't you have put like a non mentally like handicapped person? Oh well, I, that's a good. Uh, that's a good question. Okay, here's the that's real question. I mean, here's the real question. Don't you think there's a real question? Don't you think there's a guys? Guys, there's a real question. Don't you think there's a consent problem with like the mentally handicapped? I think. Like, I, think I didn't know I was unaware. He is mentally handicapped. Oh, you were point. unaware yeah. that she was mentally handicapped. Okay, okay. Oh, think about it this I way. Mean, think about it this way. Me, two matter hanging out. Bo Blacks is there. He's on the bed. He's hanging out. He's got his panties on, pulled up. Okay, okay. he's got a nice g-string. We take out our dicks. Bo Blacks says, "I want it." Can we go for that? Bo Blacks is absolutely too mentally retarded to consent. To <laughs> so there's your answer. Oh, come on. Bo Blacks might be so retarded that if he masturbates, he's himself. That's how stupid Bo Blacks is. That's terrible to say. Wait, but what if Two Matt didn't know that he was. She was mentally ill. You didn't. Yeah, Two Matt didn't know that let me let me sweeten the deal a little bit, okay? Bo Blacks is there and he tells me I am mentally. But. Even though I can't consent legally, I think that ethically I should be able to suck your dick. What do I say? What? Well, ethically, wait, wait, people can't what? legally what? consent. Wait, what? I didn't even know that. <laughs> I actually That's what didn't he, even know. That. I guess there was a court case. I don't know. I, I, I don't exactly know. Shout out, Bobby. No, Bobby. Tom, Tom, wait, no, 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 Tom. Rephrase that again because I need to. I need to hear that. <laughs> yeah, okay, so so I'm hanging out with Two Mad. We're at we're at a strip we're at a strip mm. club in L.A. Okay, a girl comes okay. over and she's a prostitute and she says you can grab my and he Two Mad grabs her dick. How how would fault is he like like her dick? Yeah, her dick. Some of you said. So we're, some we're back to trans now. Okay, cool, 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 cool. Okay, cool. What do you mean back? He oh, brought no. it up. I'm well, just sweetening the deal over here. Okay, I'm keeping things interesting. Oh, Why are you want to quiet? How are you sitting here? How do you? 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 How it's on like the other side of Maybe the fucking body. Maybe it's really long and snake-like. Like. Snake -like. Maybe it's long and snake-like and it wraps around in such a way that it could be made contact with. They, when they prosecute cases like that, it, it, it gets weird, you know? <laughs> no, we don't know. Right. We we don't don't know. Know. I, don't know. I can't, can't say that I ever have experience with that. that, that so in long. particular yeah. case, I've never heard of it, oh, so fuck. you got it, man. It seems like you laid out the facts for the prosecutor like, pretty well, good. You did say that I could touch your but then it's like you touched his dick or whatever the his wait did you know she was mentally handicapped or not yes or no i don't think no he didn't not 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 really what, is, what does that mean like no i think really. she just has mentally handicapped a yes or no too we didn't need a yes like, or no did you know or not did you find out later on like how did yeah. you figure this out man I'll say that I wasn't. I definitely wasn't focused on that. I didn't think much about like. Shit. <laughs> but you had like a. You had like a. No, no, but but you had like a thirty percent fucking chance, right? Like you had like a thirty percent like perception on that, right? Like you kind of knew. It's not like you were totally oblivious. Well, like, to the yeah, mental yeah, handicap. Yeah, when you girl. when she hung out a dress, did her parents drop her off? That would be a question you yeah. asked. Before she sucked your she dick, drives she, Audi, bro. Bro. she, she drives, drives an Audi, bro. She drives a fucking Audi. She a rich bitch. Did she drive there? Did she drive okay, there? Or when she did, did when she came in, drop her off, or did she drive there? When she came into your room, did she grab the Among Us plushie? Yes or no? Absolutely, I did worse. Okay, then she's mentally handicapped. Picked him up. 
Yeah. Got involved. Like, done, dude. You, you yeah. should have stayed yeah, away. Too bad. There's she, one particular no, part where I believe she describes um, she feels you hugging her from behind and your dick was out. Yeah, she, she felt you hard against boner. her. Is that, she confused your boner yeah, with wow. your dick being out? Oh, yeah, I, that's could be what her testimony is. Her testimony is really weird. I feel like, okay, oh. do you do you ever remember a time you're hugging her from the back, she's maybe not that into it, and your your penis is out over the, you know, like the waistband? No. no. Okay. I just that means you got a big dick. That's crazy. Here's a big dick. Yeah, dick. true. What if you were wearing very thin? What if he was wearing very thin? What if he was wearing very thin um basketball shorts? Nah, still impressive. With no underwear. Really the same. Like it's the same. Well, man, you guys are fucking mad as a guy. You guys are micro penises if you think that's impressive. Jesus Christ. I feel like you guys got no, with lobsters that sticking out. Like, I'm sorry, man. My back 13 inches. Jesus Christ. If somebody's wearing <laughs> jeans and it feels like the the um dick is Dude, just hanging out, have you heard? Okay, I've seen crazy. I've seen Mudahar's Kiwi Farms page. He's got that B I C. Do not question it. Okay, no question it. Mm. Nick, the pen. Yeah, the pen. I swear to God, I thought about the pen. Wait, hold on. Oh, wait. The, the thin cock. There's no way we about to spin around on this man's case. <laughs> this is no way. <laughs> <laughs> He's He's that. I feel like I feel like too mad. You just like dug yourself another yeah, hole. Uh, like, another hole. With I'm because we literally asked you, it's like, okay, did you uh, know that this woman had mental issues? Did you manipulate? The manipulation was enough. The mental issues was like the f cherry on the. What if I have mental issues? Yeah, do you feel really guilty, Tumat? Yeah, that's what actually... I think. Yeah, wait, hold on. No, no, wait. Really what if Tumat is also is? like mentally handicapped? No, honestly. What mental, Tumat, what like... mental handicaps do you believe you have, Tumat? Right. You know, just not normal. That's it. I feel like we've been on this question for a long time. Are we time, trying to make it, it I'm up? I'm not uh, even exactly even sure what the field? question is, to be honest with you. I don't know what the question is either. I'm curious as to why he's. No, wait, like I thought you guys wanted. No, wait, 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 wait. Hold on. I, I, I remember some. Oh, hey, Destiny, wow. take over. Oh, Destiny, wow. take over. She you got the question. I, I don't remember I the person. You don't even I know the question, why. dude. This is your job. This is your one job. I'm pretty sure I know the question. He asked too mad. Did you, wait, he said. Wait, wait, hey, shut the f up, ugly. He said too mad. Did you, <laughs> did you rate? The you won't even show your face. You're so. Up looking, you probably got half Who your face cut off in the invasion no, of you, Kabul. Okay, or you're gay, just say you're gay. Just say you're gay. You want to see another man that bad? Nigga, what the? F I'll DM you. Holy N word. Don't no, DM no. me. Is he black? Are you gay. black? Are you really a man you, privately you, outside wait, of who, the work who just situation? Said N -word. That is wait, wait. Gay. Wait, who the f just said N word? Like, oh my god, this guy's a who the f just said that? I'm talking about. I'm not. I'm not hey, I say that, bro. I don't. I don't care, bro. I don't think you're not. I'm not. I'm not Middle Eastern. I'm straight from Gujarat. You know what I mean? I'm Indian. 100. Is that, bro? My condolences, bro. Yeah. I'm kidding. I'm not Indian. First of all, I'm African, so honestly, I get first dibs on the N word. I'm like one of the ones who didn't get it get on the boat. But guys, since you guys don't want to engage, see, like, isn't that like proof of mental handicapness? What the f do you mean, too, man? You live in the White House. You just said that randomly. And by the way, I, I just want to say something. No glazing, no dick sucking, but shame on all you niggas starting with Turkey Tom and ending with Turkey Tom. Because I swear to God, if this court case goes against two men, he'll be the first nigga sitting there like, I just can't stand this nigga. This nigga is terrible. But you niggas sit here and try to farm the out of them, you shameless rats. Honestly, I just got to learn the game. That's what you guys have a lot of stuff. Anyways, uh, listen, two men free you. Unless you're guilty, then, you know, stay locked up. Anyways, <clears throat> let me ask you another question, guys. And I'm curious about your take here. Since you guys don't believe that none of you want to hold YouTube accountable because you guys are like, listen, YouTube is variable. They accept certain things or they act on certain things. They don't act on other things. And it is what it is. You just got to live with it. You said with the DMCA system, oh, there are certain cases that they handle it this way. But when there's an identical case with somebody else, they leave it. Speaking of that, somebody else, Speed accidentally flashed his package you know what i mean on his youtube stream the other day youtube decided to not ban him after his effort to remove the stream from the platform do you think no. that youtube plays favorites like twitch does or did they actually consider his intent in their decision no every platform okay. plays favorites if, okay, if, you have more if you have more subscribers you're always going to have more uh benefits from any standpoint, same thing with Hollywood celebrities, you could get away with more, whether it be law, you're above the law in a sense if you have a lot of I agree, but I think realistically, platforms. let's say Speed stood up like this and then just flopped his dick out and was waving it around, he would have been banned. Okay, no, there's exceptions for the, okay, uh, to is, the but rule, this is, but you know what I mean? But this is what, what I'm mean? saying, the exception in if this a, case. If I, made the, <laughs> if I made the mistake of showing my cock on stream, I would not get any.
I don't think you would have been banned. I think if you just delete the VOD, you'd be good, honestly. I mean, like, he clearly, like, jumped up, showed up for, like, half a second, and was like, oh, yeah, he was, it was an accident. You know, it was an accident. Yeah, I it wasn't like, like he was the main, like the general. Yeah. The general argument is if he since he, uh, he has more subscribers, does he get more benefits if he makes a mistake? You know, what he I mean? does. Yeah, it's undoubtedly he definitely gets more benefits. Yeah, 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 wait, you think so? Didn't no he get like? Didn't he get? Didn't he get the strike and he couldn't like? He got two strikes and he couldn't stream for like a while. That doesn't mean yeah, it doesn't mean that you're it doesn't mean that you're god, but you definitely still have benefits. Might have punished a little bit, right? Though, they did punish him like moderately. Yeah, they definitely punished him. Oh yeah, I feel like I feel like YouTube. And I could be off base here. I feel like YouTube and Twitch, as far as like playing favorites, like YouTube's way better. YouTube's way, you know. Of like course, that, I think YouTube's yeah. more faceless, which makes it better for I guess undoubtedly like, equal. <laughs> it's a lot I, of big questions. Just have a lot. I don't know. I don't know if that's better or worse. Like Twitch, it, it might be annoying to see some people play favorites, but sometimes I feel like YouTube should play more favorites, right? Like I think it's a little bit crazy when people like Linus Tech Tips have to go to Twitter to get like YouTube support. That's pretty wild in my opinion. But how does he not have a rep? How does he not have like a YouTube rep or someone to talk to? They might have reps now, but like in the past, don't you have like YouTubers with like 20 million subs going on Twitter being like, guys, we need to complain yeah, about this? That's and true, like, yeah, that's true. I always ask myself like, why are they? Yeah, why are they going to Twitter? Why aren't they asking their rep? Is like what I was. So saying. I guess like maybe not playing favorites, but having a better like support team, hiring more infrastructure for that would be really the ideal situation. Don't they already have that? Yeah, I mean but, it's not very good. Yeah, but know. they're all in like Bangladesh though, so they don't really. Yeah, dude. Apparently, I mean, help community. us out, bro. Give me their number when they f me up, bro. Just like. <laughs> You know, not inherently in any community. If you're gonna be bigger, you're gonna have more connections and people. You're gonna be on more people's radar. So of course you're gonna be the first come first serve if you're bigger than mm -hmm. a 50 sub Andy. You know what I mean? Yeah. Damn. Especially yeah. Uh, you definitely need to be bigger. To and I don't even think that's morally bad. I think that's probably how it should go. You know, like speed should get a response from YouTube faster than me if I get. That's probably how it should go. Because he's bigger than you. Yeah. There's Jackie. Well, is he, is he bigger sense. than you? It just makes sense. You know what I mean? Is he bigger than you though? Kill yourself. <laughs> <laughs> okay, wait. I got a question for you guys. Just random, right? The guy who shows his butthole, his balls. You know that guy, right? Yeah. Like, no. Who's that? Man, these questions that we are asking. People... Of course, well, I know. Well, look at the balls and balls from the internet so much. I don't understand where we're going with them like that all that much. Kratos, why are you? Snitching, bro. Okay, that was an educational video, and it helped a lot of us guys. Yeah, yeah. Great guys too. That it video just, didn't get taken yeah. down because it wasn't. That video didn't get taken down, Carantos, because it wasn't. Do you get turned yeah, on dude. watching it that video? It was just a butthole, dude. Come yeah, on. Yeah. What, what's people, wrong, what's wrong with that video? Yeah, Some I had to clean my. Issue? Did you get turned on? That's what he's asking. Did you get yeah. turned on? A two mad answer for me. I'd like listen, listen. No don't way. worry about if I got Bro, turned you listen, can't be walking about. Deflecting. Oh, no. Uh, no, stop, stop. Interesting. Okay, hold on. This ain't about above me. Us. This is about Karantos you niggas. Karantos wants to okay? be like the guy who's like above hairy us. Like hairy asshole. Realistically, his entertainment value is way lower than everyone else in this call. And as a result, he's being sucked down to the bottom. Okay? Can we vote this off and I'll be the guy that runs yeah, the show? Yeah, Vito. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Vito. Brother, brother, don't put a shirt on, nigga. You got small arms, buddy. Okay? Number one. Number two, somebody said you like Harry. Who said that? Lo, you keep saying a lot of sus. Some Listen. I'm you saying such. The last two topics brought up by you, Carantos, was about another man's balls and then Harry. That's what I'm yeah. saying. Like, you keep bringing <laughs> up these conversations. You're crotch centered, man. It's, Can you answer it's, the it's question? Did you like it or not, man? God damn. No, answer I question. didn't. I, no, okay. I didn't. He says he doesn't. Right. I watched it a couple of times, but it was for educational purposes. They don't mean I that's liked it. I did game. like it. So you watch, um, you, you clean your ass. So, so that's why that video isn't taken down, because you learned something from that video. <laughs> exactly. You weren't turned on. You learned how to clean your ass. I think we all learn a little bit. Okay? Yeah, In the words of exactly. Drake Nasheed, wash your ass. Okay? Wash your ass. You guys generally think... Yeah, wait, wait, stop, stop. Let's get serious. First of all, none of you guys have a clean yeah. ass. You Let's dirty, get serious. Just brings up... Butthole. You Let's probably don't serious. even wash your ass. Yeah, you're disgusting, especially bro, you, I got you a look bidet, like, dude. Like it washes my ass for me, bro. <laughs> okay, <laughs> wait, Muda, that at all. Muda, Muda, I know you got the minimum, at least you grew up with the bucket, you know what I mean? So, like, I get that. But with all the these bucket, other things, I live in the first world. I had the bidet, dude. Shit's What's automated. Bucket? Targets your ass with IR lasers, dude, bro. You're good, question, dude. <laughs> yeah, wait, is, is it the one that shoots up your ass? or something i mean the question yeah, was dude. should that content be allowed on youtube because again there was a woman that got banned for breastfeeding her child but then they called it child I'm porn wait wait wait, wait wait are you asking us if I'm we're having another uh, on 
Uh, YouTube, real quick, go to. Be yeah, I'm asking you. You should you fucking just show your yeah. content on yeah. YouTube, regardless of whether it's. I think you should be allowed to. Content or I think I think if I'm making yeah. if I'm making a comedic video and my butthole is really funny because it looks f up, I think I should be able to show that to the world. Okay. Augers, show us, Tom. Show us, you little freak. I'd like to willingly <laughs> sacrifice myself for this do next it. round. Can I do that? the worst question on that. Yeah, you should be allowed to show your. Bro, shut the up! Listen, it's been a while since I've had a rat that about the questions. Lyrics, you got them. Bum, shut the f up! You got them bottom feeding, got them cockroach. You're Listen, asking the question. You don't like the question. Another man's hold on, hold on. Ass. You don't the like the question. Bottom? First of all, first of all, it's not. Have you seen another man's? The f guy's you video asked. has 15 million plus f views. At this point, I'd be surprised if nobody, like, if none of you niggas have seen it, which low. Oh, it's an it, educational it. video. It's You're educational, not supposed bro. to get turned on. That's it. it Everyone mad at the breastfeeding one was educational too, and she. Got put in prison for. Well, then years. you know what? That video shouldn't be taken down. That's an egregious yeah. error too. And by the way, kids aren't watching that video because it's age restricted. So YouTube's at least told us that you have to be over the age uh, of eighteen kids to be the educated. Age restriction. What, what is? What is what are you being retarded about on this? purpose? What's two meds take? What does two meds think about this? Nobody lies about their age. Look at that. You're over the eight, eight Bro, it doesn't matter. <laughs> Lots of people lie <laughs> about their age. You your YouTube putting it up there. I didn't know the age of the. Can sure I truly asshole. be blamed for gazing into the eye of Sauron? I think. Mm -hmm. no. Speaking of the eye of Sauron, we have Too Mad as the winner of the last round. Let's Congratulations, go. Too Mad. Congratulations. Whoa. And now, Too Mad, you get to decide who is innocent and who is convicted to be exiled from the show. And you have to choose between Branding, Buckingham, and Lyrics. Yeah, I'm going to sacrifice myself. I got to go. So I'm going to do that for you, Too Mad. Bye bye, man. But I appreciate you guys having me. Wait, on. wait. Lyrics was on the chopping block, and you want to sacrifice yourself? Holy fuck. Yeah, I lyrics. gotta go. Yeah, I gotta go. But I appreciate you guys having me. You're attractive. On. So, I how's it going? You're not a twink, Brandon. Ew. Okay, Ew. genius. Holy f First of all, let's see. 15 minutes. <laughs> 15 minutes, okay? 15 I know you don't minutes. listen to me when I tell you. Yeah, 15. Because we're down to four, right? Do I know how to count? Is it four? It's four, right? Yeah, it's round. No, it's. Yeah. Five. No, four. Five, yeah. Yeah. No, five. It's five. What the fuck? This, is a <laughs> dude, this is a show. Dude, I don't know. We've been it's talking about cocks and assholes. We've been talking about cock and assholes and balls right now. Brother, he doesn't stutter once when he talks about cock and assholes. But he stutters now. Okay, okay, okay. Let me call out. Let me call out the hypocrisy a little bit. It's keep or kick, not sucker. Okay, so because yeah, first of all, it is kick or keep. So we talk about any and everything. Okay, we're not like some highbrow show. This ain't flagrant. Okay. We're more like mm -hmm. the other niggas. Shout out Nell. By the way, Lo, weren't you the guy when Sneeko broke his whole cuck story on your playback podcast? He talked about seeing another man's dick, blah, blah, blah. And you loved that story. You're like, oh, please tell me more. You stood there. Oh, you laid next to him. But we talk about dick for five minutes. And you're like, oh, this is too good for me, man. I don't want to talk about it. Brother, you said it was too nothing bad. wrong. I just want diversity instead it. of dick and butthole. That's it. I yeah, there was diversity. diversity. Dick and ass, nigga. We went front and back. Oh, okay. All right. So are you going to go back to it, though? Topics. Are you going to double back no. on it? Yeah. Honestly, if your girl yeah, fingers in the booty hole, he wants to. He wants to. No, no, let me ask you. I, I, I'll ask you. I'm going to go into it. This don't, listen, yeah, go, go okay, into okay, it, okay, right. okay, okay, It's a cock Okay, okay. Go if your girl it. sticks a finger in your booty when she's giving you the slurp slurp, you know what I mean? Is it? I'm curious. Okay, I have a very, very, very No, bro, because it's a fuck. Girl, do it. a girl, do but I've actually thought about it and I anal. wanted to try a little bit of you know anal play. But I and I need somebody to ask anal play, anal play. Dude. It is with that. It's literally I with think that. that the butthole what are is talking about? the butthole is undoubtedly the doorway, sure. as is any anal sex. And so I think if you're engaging in that, you're getting dangerously your close. Okay, you're getting dangerously close. You're you're. I think you're 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 bordering. Because if you think about it this way, the. Okay, mm -hmm. and the boobs are the parts of the are the parts of the girl that the guy doesn't have. Okay, have. if you're entering the butthole, is the most qualified. Go be with the man, okay? Because the it's man's true. probably gonna have a tighter butthole than her, he frankly. So just go to the guy. No, I'm not. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not talking about me. Like he just asked. If, if your ass is being my explored dick. too, no, just go you, get no, a guy. Her, like, go get a guy, bro. Go get a freaking. Yeah, it doesn't say. Yeah, yeah, it doesn't say. Yeah. You're like uh, no, you're you're like house phone on on no jumper, bro. You 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 you're still you're still attractive. You're still attracted. You're attracted to women, so you want a woman to if suck your dick. If you're attracted to like, something entering the worst your butt, you are, you are a man. I'm not saying you're attracted like to it. 
you you're not attracted to it. You're just you're wondering. You're curious. Come on, dog. Okay. Dude, that makes you're you. Listen to me. Listen to me. I have the most nuanced take on this that none of you have thought about, okay? You can be curious about a lot of things. When I drive by the homeless camp every day, I think about driving my car through it, but I don't because I would go to jail. And frankly, you think about that? I mean, look. I have intrusive thoughts, okay? I have I can't help it. I'm just, I have intrusive thoughts. Okay, and no, frankly, and frankly, and frankly, no, no, no. and frankly, there's a difference though because I haven't done that, and when I do that, I will be mm. convicted of murder. Okay, and if you let something enter your butt, the second you're something terrible. actually enters and goes beyond thought and goes to action, you're, you're not dead. No, you're. I oh, mean, you're. I mean, yeah. you're full blown. You're be minimum. Women. I think yeah, you're, you no. just flip to being gay because, like, it's just. Uh, I think. I think. I, I think the concern. In, I think the concern of me going to jail for murder and me being are such on different ends of the spectrum that I'm okay yeah, with being gay. Yeah, being first, nigga. What the fuck are you okay, doing, oh, bro? Number one. Okay, Number okay, two. Okay. Wait, hold on. Let me hold get into on, it. You keep on, trying to go. On. Guys, I was joking. Sponsors, please. Okay, we want more than one sponsor in two months. Anyways, let me ask you this, low. You're like, if a girl does it, it's not so what if a girl like just puts on a strap on and just like takes you from the back like bah! like just that's rape right. that's rape right, dude that's worse than what two <laughs> bad did. okay do you do you <laughs> want do you want the strap on sense. like is that what you think of do you want the no strap but it, on, like dude? what's the difference between a finger and a strap on like other than what's the, the difference between I don't know, there's a strap on there's a Size difference, a pretty yes, big one. Yeah, I said other than yeah. the size, you fucking idiot. I mean, you other than the size, it's a pretty big difference, though. <laughs> you can argue about the size difference, but like, if you've killed one guy versus ten, like, you're still going away. You know, like, I don't know. I don't really. Give a, I don't really you give take a, a shit. Finger like, or a once you open that door, you're officially through it. Okay, whether it's one inch, whether it's her little pinky, okay, or whether it's Tyrone Magnus, okay. Either way, Tyrone Magnus. Tyrone Magnus is crazy. <laughs> Wait, Muda, you don't think he's at all, right? Like, if your girl just, like, plays with your booty? <laughs> I don't like, dude, yeah, I don't really care, bro. She she wants to... First off, conversation I, I, don't, I don't think it's... I, I would never be okay with that, okay? I don't want to be, like... I don't want my... to be penetrated. I think that's that's a weird Thank feeling, you. all right? What I don't about, really what care. About, what about licked? What about licked? Oh, what you, ooh, you freaky I don't care, bro. Keep just, talking, dude, bro. Bro, listen, I'm, like, probably the most <laughs> vanilla man in... I don't really care, okay? I... 15, 20 minutes, I'm out for the night, it's done, dude, okay? I don't think about minutes. pinkies in the uh, Bro, I just don't minutes? care about any of that shit, all right? Yeah, 20 minutes, bro, I'm in and out like a Navy SEAL, and then I'm in beat. bed, and I got shit to do. <laughs> two minutes got you beat. Two minutes got me beat by like 19 hours. minutes and 55 seconds, bro. He's <laughs> got it. <laughs> all right, Q, let's get a better question. You have question. another question? Like, like, come on, yeah. man. Okay, first of all, Lyrics dickhead. If you can't have fun, I recommend you shut the f up. Low. You a freaky ass nigga, by the way. Like, this nigga needs to go into a I never said I did it. I just, I've thought about it. I never said I did it. I thought about it. Bro, we have spent, you want to honestly, do girl, we have honestly, spent 30 low. minutes talking about pinkies and... That's what I'm saying. saying. I think that no, if we had said it's not, you would have been like, well, that's good, because last night I let my girl stick her whole hand up my oh, ass. Oh, trust me. My, your your oh, opinion about my... I don't care. I'm going to do whatever I want to do with it, man. Your opinion doesn't really... He's going to do whatever he wants with his asshole. Why do you ask This nigga said, I'll be, panel, I'll be, and I'll be proud, and it don't matter what you say. I mean, okay, I just, I'm asking because I don't know if any of you all have tried that, so that's why I'm asking, like, how does, like, what is your... I don't think that's right, man. Okay, let me ask you guys something else. And Lyrics, you could jump in, you intellectual mole rat. Okay. <clears throat> when <laughs> reporting on other rock. creators... <laughs> Okay, don't say that. That's Islamophobic. Okay, you know, I say that and I work with little Steve. Okay, we're reporting on other creators' drama. Should you be held to the same standard as regular journalists? I'm curious. What's your opinion on this? You know, what? everybody, shut the f up, please. With all due respect, I want lyrics to take the floor. Go ahead. What's your opinion on this, my um, good sir? Journalist has honestly become really a uh, weird profession in the past few years. I mean, anyone, it seems like, can just write, like, an article about whatever the f and they don't seemingly have to fact-check much unless they're working for some, like, big, big pork corporation. So, I mean, I think so. But even if we take it to the ultimate extreme where journalists have to fact-check everything, I think they 
it's probably good if you're reporting on a situation. I mean, this is an ideal world. It's probably good if you're going uh, to give both sides, to give facts and evidence, to give sources and whatnot like that. Is it ever going to happen? No, it's a pipe dream. But in a perfect world, I mean, that's good. You know, that's what we should strive for. I feel like if you're reporting on anything, you should strive to get accurate facts and reporting. That should just be a given. Like, even if you're a journalist of the New York Times or you're Jim Bob with a YouTube channel. You should just try to get facts. That's it. There's That's no like views. yeah. But what do you mean by they should be held accountable? Like, does that imply consequences? Yeah. Well, like, like he, are we gonna get like civilly charged? But he, he said like, he said held to journalistic. Like, I, I don't even think like, what is like being you held said, to journal. journalistic. I, I agree. No I want to say because yeah, exactly. Even they're not held to it. So like, I am trying to not be like too technical and nitpicky. Technically, yes, like we should be held because we are still we, ha we hold some level of power and influence like, over what's I, happening. Like, to people. I, I think it depends. I feel like job. Like, I feel I like know. from my perspective, and this is something like defamation law also reflects, which is that like intent does matter. So like if you knowingly defame someone on purpose and like that can be proven, then that's to me different mm -hmm. than falsely reporting facts. The consequences can still be the same, and there should be consequences. But I think in my mind, okay, intent does matter. Maybe that's a little. I don't know. Ish, but I think it matters. For sure. Yeah, but you even of, okay. you'll always just have a lot of retards who think they're presenting the facts, but they never actually do it. So it's going to be so hard to implement. You know what I mean? Yeah. I mean, unfortunately, YouTube and journalists are probably just as bad on equal terms. So yeah, <laughs> it sucks. Mm. Okay, it but you oh, wait, hold on, Turkey. Turkey, you said that intent matters. So if somebody is purposefully not trying at all to like give you the facts give you the story as it is with all the details provi provided right you think that person should at least face some sort of consequences whether it be like you know losing their channel because again you guys i keep going back to it you guys don't think that nick should lose his channel but I fresh and fit because they reported a couple of people I okay, no because okay. Fresh and Fit broke DMCA. Carantos, rule you are on you are intentionally downplaying the severity of what Fresh yeah. and Fit did. They intentionally abused the copyright system, which is a legal matter. Which, by the way, copyright is like the fabric that holds our content together. None of us are making like films mm -hmm. where they're all our own production. We're talking about stuff that other people do. And so when Fresh and Fit abuse the copyright system, they attack the very fabric that holds the internet and what we do as content creators together. Yeah. I think that is. I don't know that it's demonstrably worse, but it's definitely worse to me than what Nick is not green did. Nick is not green at the very least thinks he's doing the right thing. Fresh and fit, I think know they're doing something wrong. They know. They yeah. know, and they're doing it. Yeah, fresh and fit are and violating an actual legal. Yeah, Just, they're violating an actual. Legal and even legal outside of that, Carantos, um, once again, I wouldn't cry if Fresh and Fit got deplatformed, but I would shy away from encouraging any YouTube involvement. I just, I really don't want that precedent, um, except for like people who are grooming kids on the platform. That would be one. There's probably a few other, you know, examples. Like if you're, yeah, if you're that's like what people on video, involved. Christchurch style, you should be banned for that. But otherwise. Right. Yeah, Carantos, as you could, as you said, if you can prove that somehow they're like going out of their way to try to defame someone or doesn't give a f like Nick is not green saying he doesn't give a f about finding the facts to the situation here. Um, I think it would just be much more of a consequence for we to try to get YouTube to come in. It should be more of a matter of the two parties at play where if someone really I mean, thinks they're getting to make that, that's probably to, the best yeah. system that we could have to make know? that even work. It's like, what are you going to add like a group of fact checkers on youtube that's make sure that every allegation it'll is never true be honest consistent yeah. yeah exactly that's, it's like, that's the real I problem i mean twitter yeah. has community guidelines right or like community notes or something everybody like that, right? oh the yeah. community yeah, notes. Yeah, yeah, I'm sure, I'm sure yeah, community no half the time the community yeah. notes are wrong okay because everyone on twitter doesn't know anything so i don't i don't i don't really want that either and if youtube implements the system once again it's going to be outsourced to mudahar's cousin and they're not going to know how to speak english and they're going to it up okay they're they're hey, that's hey, that's, 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 I'm that, sorry. That's you, a, the real he does speak problem. English. He's a good guy. I bought a car from him. He's a I good guy. Yeah, I, I show I showed him Duolingo. He's figuring it out, bro. <laughs> he's, so he's my, so my, in my opinion, the, the much bigger problem isn't isn't that we're like having somebody else handle it. It's like specifically YouTube and like the amount of videos that they would have to like go over, the type of people they had to curate to make sure this is going correctly while also being consistent. Not only is it not like very legit like realistic for them to do it like the logistics behind it also was just so astronomically high that i can't expect youtube to do it yeah. and even when youtube attempts to do it they Damn so it. many different times that like it's i much rather us to just kind of deal with it on our own Good. or That's get our own communities yeah. and, and deal Definitely. with it it's, so it's it's yeah. a lot of it yes. just has to do with the fact that it's just youtube in and of itself undoubtedly it is an insurmountable your, your, your butt buddies youtube like also, it's fun, it's fun we're at the end YouTube. of the round we are at the end of the round and we are doing oh. another vote good luck uh, Who comes up with these questions? 
The guy, who, 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 the, the guy that beheaded a journalist last week in the middle. Okay, that guy. We need two, man. We need. Okay, two school questions. shooter, shut the f up. You goddamn. Pe I don't know why white niggas talk about beheadings and. Sh like, you know what? I'm not gonna be racist. What the I'm, fuck sorry. Is that I'm sorry. Face? I'm sorry. I'm, I'm coming sorry. for you, buddy. Okay. Dude, just like, you, is this I'm like, hiring you look mercenaries. Like every school shooter. You look like every single school shooter that dude, ever existed. They're and you're talking ancestry, shit about okay? me. Yeah, you look like you're about to behead house. someone on cam, dude. I think that if you bully a child to the point... I'm just kidding. I'm not gonna, <laughs> we're not gonna go down that line. What do you mean, child? Dude, what do you mean I, you're not gonna be racist? You're, you're mad here's a child. No, don't. I'm about to say two... What? Dude, man, immediately the one word you noticed was child, dude. Child. That wasn't... Me, that was uh, Mudar. That was and then question, what? question, That's what does it mean mad. to be a child? What does that yeah, mean? Too mad. How do you feel about nice one, low, nice one. Let's Too mad. How do you feel about Columbine? Yeah, okay, big picture. Uh, I feel like Columbine was definitely your doing. I, I think you're an for that, bro. Why did you do that? Dude, I just feel like, Ooh. look, I just messaged, Maggie. I just messaged Eric and like, I was like, yo, what's up? And he was like, I'm playing Doom and I get on next week. Thirteen kids are dead. It's not my fault, bro. I was just trying to play. Well, you Doom. shouldn't have went there with him with the Tech Nine. Dude, I was, he said he was going to do shooting practice after school. Students. Not at school, dude. 12. Not at, you not at 12 school. 12 kids. Okay, one of them, dude, What's wrong two with of you? them were them. Two of them were them, okay? Don't do any of that. Just, just kill 12. Dude, I thought it was going to be after school, okay? I didn't know it was going to be on school grounds, okay? In fairness, we did, it, we did put it, we, in fairness, we did put it you in the, your dog we, too. okay, no, we did put it in the locker, but I just thought we'd been taking it out after school, like nobody, you, you know. A fucking bomb and it didn't work, dude. There's like, in, there's GPT Okay, I was not responsible for that. that. That was you. I know that you designed that, that specifically. You? I've Hold seen on. this too, man, would you trans girl? Would you trans girl too, man? That nice one, lyrics. If I asked that, I'd be like, oh my God, these questions, shut up. All right. Well, hey, listen up, listen up. Exciting times, exciting times. We do indeed have a round winner. And it is Turkey Tom. Oh! Hope to kick somebody last time? I don't think you did, right? Wasn't it? Uh, not last no. time, no. Oh, no okay. last time. It was Muda. Turkey Tom, you need to choose between lyrics and low. Um, White versus black crime. I think I'm gonna. <laughs> you, better, you better tread lightly. Listen, I've Rude. been accused of being racist guy. in the past. <laughs> I've been accused of being racist in the right. past, and as much as I want to, as much as I, as much as I, I don't want to validate that. I think I'm gonna have to go with um, the Aryan guy because they lost the war. I think they're gonna have to lose kick or keep as well. So it's been nice having you, buddy. Take care. Yep. All right. Appreciate you guys having me. Have a good. Yeah. <laughs> have a good one. Wait, Too shut mad. yourself out. Your court case. Larix on YouTube. Too mad. You're guilty. No, I'm not. Oh, Wait, he what? waited till the end to say that? You pussy, That's come crazy. back. That's crazy. Oh, That's crazy. My, oh my god, you spineless yes. rat. Oh, too mad. Final the final five. The way, oh, I, actually, final four. The final four. Yeah, no. nice. I'm the only Wait, people this round, What the f How did I get to this point? This Turkey round Tom is double elimination, by the way. Out. This round is double elimination. It is so two people will go home with... Zero. By the making way, making up rules on the fly is crazy. It, I'm not making up. Low, why you on my dick, nigga? Why you on I'm my dick? Saying, I, I, I just want, why you on my dick? Bro, 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 this bro, has bro, been done for the past Don't let him go. He's going to talk about coming on faces soon. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> but yeah, but I'm interested. Uh, you guys eat pineapples before you actually. I'm not going to get into it. Am I the only version? The answer to the question the is yes, though, actually. I have pineapples downstairs, so yes, I do do that. Oh, Wait, so you plan... Wait, why am I asking that? That's disrespectful, my bad. I was going to ask, like, do you plan on just, like, busting inside her mouth or something? I don't know. I've always found it weird. I don't want to talk about this too much. But the idea not. that... Of course not. Of course not. Of course not. No, no, course, but course. It, I'm just saying yeah, the idea that a woman... Not too, too long, yeah. Like, come on. Uh -huh. The idea of a woman getting on her knees and just eating your... Like, your sweaty, nasty balls, even though you washed it, this is pretty... Just, uh, Yo, that's just, a pretty fucking... haram topic to talk about. Dude, whoa, dude. What does Borat right. call it? He's like, he's like, I'm he's like that gypsy eat my haram. I'm just saying. He calls it. I think that's a good way to put it. Okay, right. Turkey Tom. You, listen, it's another language. So, you, like, you want to start putting in everything? You idiot. He's okay. I have a question for you. Kazakhstan, bro. You know that's how they talk. About Who's from? I'm Kazakhstan. Bulgarian. I'm Bulgarian, so I think I have a right to make fun of people from no, that region. You're black. Uh, you look Bulgarian, buddy. Wait, Anyways. you're black. You're delusional too. So you're both. Wow. Who's black? Turkey Tom. Yeah, this nigga is freezing like he's Aiden. Speaking of Aiden <laughs> Ross, um, does Aiden Ross's boundary pushing content and willingness to embrace controversial figures such as Charleston White, which by the way, I am impressed that that nigga did not get the Andrew Tate treatment. Holy 
he went on Fresh and Fit and basically said, we used to, I don't like to say the outward word, white woman. You know what I mean? Shout out reparations. Hey. I'm kidding, I'm kidding. Um, such as Charleston White helped to connect with a younger audience and reflect the ever-evolving nature of online entertainment, or does it risk normalizing inappropriate behavior and dangerous values among his viewers? I want us to pause for a second, and I want us to acknowledge that is not his question because he wanted to ask another dick question. You can clearly hear him reading that <laughs> shit off yeah, word dude. for word. You can clearly hear him reading it off. Down. Okay, I write the questions down. I don't think, think I don't oh. prepare myself. His brain was like oh. already a dick <laughs> coming. <laughs> I think the difference is a reasonable, <laughs> reasonable suspicion oh, or a reasonable, oh. a reasonable expectation, which is a high standard to meet. The Charleston White is gonna is gonna be some people from his audience, and I think that you know maybe there should be some action taken. Are you projecting? What is this Aiden I, Ross question? You're I, projecting. Okay, no, no, it's about it's about I, Aiden Ross. It's about Aiden Ross platform. Okay, 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 There's okay. a reasonable no, expectation. You? Then would I feel that bad for Aiden Ross getting owned? No. What I think Aiden Ross should probably be owned for ahead of that is uh, his crypto scams, which he has done blatantly. Yeah, MILF token, all that yeah. shit. But but outside yeah. of that, like as far as the spreading ideology stuff, like I don't really buy that. I think if someone's spreading bad ideology, you can meet it with good ideology, you can have a good conversation with them, you can convince yeah, the I think, I think why they're wrong. I, I so also think, think if you're in, I'm sorry. You know, I no, also he doesn't. I think I if you're an doesn't. Aiden Ross viewer, you're already too far gone mentally, so it doesn't really matter. I don't think what the you are, dude. I think I fuck. think that a lot of Aiden Ross viewers are Here comes the white are, savior. A lot of Aiden Ross viewers are probably like younger people who just find him really funny. They probably don't really buy into his ideology that much. Just like with Sneeko, sure. a lot of people just watch the train wreck. Are there some people that are beyond mm -hmm. the pale? Yes, but there's some people that are that, that are beyond reasoning in any situation in any community on the internet. Not in I, my community. Uh, I yeah, think they're all lost that a lot Trump of your community niggas. is very... F okay, okay, we're not getting into that. My community is the smartest one on the internet. They are the, the, the most... The only, the the only reason relax. why, the only reason why I don't like that, that, and I'm not saying you necessarily are dying on this, but that argument of, like, if you confront it with, like, more positive energy. Like, I don't think Aiden doesn't do that, though. So, like, yeah, I have no problem if, like, you're willing to take on more complex conversations with people or bring on more controversy people on your platform to challenge them or to give, like, a fair balance back and forth. But Aiden doesn't do that. That's he, he's true. just a part of the... That's true. He's just a part of the train wreck. That's but all I also, I also don't think that Aiden has a responsibility to do that i think aiden is clearly he does it no no he does it. entertainment above all else he yes. doesn't really have any real ideals and so for that it's like would it be nice if he did that yeah am i expecting him to do that no yeah aiden and is I, just a I guy that does stupid sh all the time just and for as the far sake as, of wait, as far as people laugh involved, like, hold on, hold on, if, if Tom, Tom. okay okay wait no 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 you're gonna let me finish. almost you're gonna let me finish carantos you host nobody gives a about you you should get okay i'm muted you suck my dick i was gonna let you finish but you said that you forgot that in this room nigga I'm not going to say that. I was about to be blasphemous. Anyways, let me ask you guys this. Oh, okay. Let's on continue. <laughs> okay. No, um, continue. You're wait, unmuted. I can continue now? You interrupted the whole thing to yeah. mute me, and now I can go on? Dude, yeah, pretty much. You're the worst person of all time, Destiny. You may as Okay, well. I wanted to ask you guys this. I wanted to ask you guys on. this. Uh, shut up. I wanted to ask you guys this much, right? You guys said that Aiden Ross does not need to be responsible with his platform. Do you actually stand by by that take? No, that's I, I didn't not, say it. That's think, not what we I said. Think, yeah, I no, 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 no. You and Tom just said no, that. Bro, 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 bro. You're, you're playing a game said. of telephone by yourself. Yeah. I did yeah, not are. say that he no doesn't need to that. be responsible. We're, we're, we're saying, wait, no, no, Mura, Mura, you didn't say yeah. it. You didn't say it, but Tom and Lo both said, oh, he doesn't need to be responsible. He doesn't need to represent both sides, blah, blah, blah. Like, his job is to entertain. Tom, you literally said that, and Lo, you agreed with it. Okay, okay, okay. But the question is, the question is, Dickhead, the question about responsibility, the question about responsibility is who is going to hold him accountable? Do I think Kick should hold him accountable if the guy he's bringing on is actively members of Aiden's audience, which from what I understand was, was the thing that was brought up in the first place? Yes, Kick should hold him accountable. If he's not, Wait, if he's just... Is that what he's doing? That what Charles no. White is doing? Why? What the? F is, what? You you Tom, fucking you you, you you said the thing with the thing from the get go was this guy came out Aiden Ross's stream that had like women in the past. No, he went yeah. on Fresh and Fit podcast. He, he went on Fresh and Fit, and then he went on Aiden like recently. Yes. Okay. But but he when he but these are things that he claims that he did years ago, and he okay. justifies it because they're white so, women. So I don't. And he does. He's not. He, from my understanding, I don't think he's actively doing. Okay. It. I mean, okay, so, so this White is, is, this is a crack okay, 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 okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is yeah. what I'm saying. This is what I'm saying. Yeah. This is what I'm saying. If there's an expectation that he's actively engaging in crimes, and there's like some kind of proof there that he's trying to engage in that, then they should ban him. And maybe Aiden Ross, if he continually platforms him and tries to give him a voice, if he does that. Otherwise, 
No. All right, You're so before... inconsistent. The proof is he admitted it. What the f he literally, it's like, he, 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 he could just he argue it for entertainment value. I mean, like, I mean, I don't know. I mean, having, having somebody that's claimed to have people in the past is like a no, no, you should just never have that person. Yes. On yeah, I agree. Right. I agree. You shouldn't, you shouldn't, you shouldn't. But do I think that mm -hmm. Aiden should be banned from kick? No. And also that undermines kicks entire business model, which is, I mean, I know they do ban people, but kick is, but he said he should be banned. You just made the that question up. is what should Nobody happen. Should the question is what should happen. The question is how should he help responsible? No, the should question is shouldn't content creator. No, no, no. The question is shouldn't large content creators be responsible with their platform? What do you mean? Yes be or no? Responsible? What does that mean? If he's not going to be responsible, oh, stop, then someone needs to hold him responsible. That. White woman. Yeah, but okay. No. To, to to Q, yes, yes, people should be responsible. The the what I'm saying is that. I don't hold Aiden Ross as a content creator in the same light of someone to challenge someone else for me to hold him accountable in those regards. I'm I'm looking at Aiden Ross as somebody who just does crazy dumb to just entertain. That's what he does. And, and that's all he does. I do not hold him to the standard of somebody who's going to challenge somebody and sit down and have a conversation and have an honest back and forth. And so in those regards, no. But should he bring on people that have not committed crimes and done crazy things before and just label that as entertainment and then move forward with that? You know, that I think that is insane. I think that's nuts. But no one's going to hold him accountable because, again, his audience right. isn't like they're just like kids. Like, no way they don't really give a f probably ma majority of them don't even know the things that he's done or said on other platforms anyway they just turn on a stream they see who's there they make fun haha and then move on so it's, it's not even a space for him on his stream to hold someone accountable or give responsible content beyond the fact that if he just makes a decision on bringing them I, on I, or not i, I agree it. with that and the, and the thing about the responsibility and accountability conversation is like okay who's supposed to hold them accountable Kick? Is that who you're asking to? Because if the audience won't hold them accountable, then Kick's the only person who could, which is why I made that argument in the first place, because obviously Aiden Ross's content doesn't give a Muda Muda can make 100 videos on Aiden Ross's audience. Aiden Ross will say, Aiden Ross's audience will say, El Muda, W Aiden, and move the f*** on. That's all they care about, dude. <laughs> and, then, and then also, if, if you then go down this rabbit hole of like, I can't bring on anybody who has admitted to doing something in the past. So somebody on Kick recently just got done with a um a, a case of any sort of any any sort of kind are they then going to ban them because they then said aiden brought on somebody else who did da 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 like you get down this whole rabbit hole of like what people are allowing on platforms and i just think like again i mean we're not my thing my like thing system. my thing with platform control is like don't have anything criminal going on okay so if somebody's going out murdering or like people on the on video maybe ban that immediately that, yes yes uh, scams right like actual financial fraud and scams ban that right there and then mm -hmm. like tos should be very specific i think you're getting into like um very very like edge cases uh, about like people's content when they're pushing that like edgy boundary um mm -hmm. i don't know if like a platform's really capable to to, to go down that road i don't know yeah. who decides I don't, what this like, is, that's this one is, of the issues. i don't know if it really this is also somebody who claim this is someone who claimed he did this like when he was a teenager and and Charles charleston white is like 40, 50 years old at this point. So he's, he's referring... Like, did Charleston White actually do this? Or did he just say it to be insane? Like, I don't well, even he's, know. He's, he's, like, like, that, yeah. that is true, but he's 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 said this, like, multiple times. You like, could be right. In front of Repeat You could be fit. absolutely like, right, yeah. but do we want to hold a platform responsible for making the decision of if he's joking or not? Because I don't really trust them to make that decision, um, to make that distinction at all. And frankly, not saying Aiden Ross does this, but there is educational value in talking to people who are criminals or reform criminals. I don't think that you can excuse what this guy claims he did if he did I that. I have EDP on, and let's talk to him then. How about that? No, I don't even... I don't Because he's actively doing it now. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. And, and also... And mad, also mad, there's, there's, there's Wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. When they did it. Don't I'm, interrupt me, you he didn't, you're the he, host. Didn't, he, didn't, he didn't. No, no, no. You're you're saying it wrong. He's claiming that he did these things when he was a teenager, years, decades ago. That's when he said he did it. He didn't say he was like actively two weeks ago doing it. That's not what he said. He said Does when I was matter, coming up, when way? I was. I don't think it matters. Well, he's still. So I don't really. That doesn't really matter. What I'm saying is, okay. when the differences that we're talking about is that when somebody's actively doing it, then a, a platform should come in and say, "Hey, I'm not going to allow you to have that on the stream. That's ridiculous." Or if he's going through the court case right now, where he could potentially be grooming people or talking to people on our platform to then them, then I'm not going to have that either. But if somebody did something 30 years ago. Then are we then going to sit here and say, well, because you did something 30 years ago, then you're not going to be on our platform? Is oh, that, no. Is that's it. Low, 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 low. Shut up, shut up, Q. Shut up. Nobody gives a f what you say. Lo, I, oh, wow. I have a question for you, okay? I have a question for you. Okay. okay. So let's say there's an ongoing legal case with someone, and it's unclear as to whether they are guilty, 
the public believes they're guilty, and then you I don't think that I don't think the platform should either. No, the platform should not get involved. You don't no. think the if it's get not involved? clear. Okay, so no. okay, so here's so, so here's so here's the conundrum, right? It can be clear in like a literal sense, in a legal sense, it may not be clear to us. It's obvious mm-hmm. EDP is right offending wants to groom kids. I think he just got caught for it again. Okay, um, but. For the legal system, he's not been convicted of anything for for most of the reasons. Yeah, as far as we know, he That's hasn't done I anything. That's what I argued when you guys attacked me on this. By the way, he hasn't been charged with anything legally. So why was he taken down? And both, by the way, Tom, you included. All you guys said is, "Hey, it, but he actually did it because they want to protect right, right, themselves. Right, 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 they right, right, don't right. want okay, him to okay, like." Okay, okay, okay. And, and, and here's my point. Here's my point. This is a conundrum. I don't even know what the answer is here. Okay, I'm not crying that EDP got banned. That's a good thing. But in future cases, let's say there's someone who gets falsely accused. They get taken to court or something for a criminal action. They get banned from YouTube in the interim, and then it turns out they're innocent. Like, is YouTube going to bring them back? How do we deal with a situation like that? I don't really know. I don't know. They how should. They should. If, if, I mean, I mean, proof- YouTube, YouTube has the option. It's like if you've been banned, you can file yeah. an appeal. So if the appeal says, yeah, bro, I haven't actually little kids can i get back onto the platform yeah, yeah come right. on but i'm sure up. edp says yeah, but the like content too, creator has been be fucked over back, at right? that point I'm no sure. no well, but if if like if he goes through the court process and if he's found to be innocent raw i mean i'm not even saying specific edp but if like i go if i got banned because off of public perception and then i go through my court case and now mm-hmm. it's undeniably proven true that i didn't do those things yes i should be reinstated back on youtube like, YouTube like it's also such a specific use case like if your case involves interactions with minors of course every platform is going to remove you bro right, like right. that's them getting into danger like imagine if like okay we can't prove edp's like a guilty guy because the legal system hasn't done it tomorrow okay like it turns out that oh edp was actually interacting with minors right using youtube comment sections or leading them off platform <clears throat> and youtube didn't remove the channel who the do you think the mainstream media is going to yeah, target first? Exactly. Is it going to be well, EDP a, or is it going to be YouTube and then shut us so, all down? And so it's from that perspective, I think a, YouTube should ban weapon. them, but it's just You're like muted. a Tom, shut the f*** up. Hey, you got by another white man, nigga. White and white crime. He's like, Cuban, bro. He ain't even white, Listen okay? Up. Shut up, bitch. Listen up. The final poll, or the second to last poll, just finished. Mm-hmm. And we have two survivors going on to the finals. We have Ooh. Turkey Tom and Legend of Winning. Those are our wow. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Nice. Oh, my hey. God. Nice. Oh. Hey, yo, uh, oh. I, hey, yo, Moody, they just wanted to pack you up because you just passed me. So we're basically at the same amount of votes, but it's fine. It's fine. It's cool. It's cool, man. It's cool. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to root for both of you guys. Let's see this race war go at it. Thanks, Take man. Care, Black on white crime. Right. <laughs> Take care, there we go. Muda, thank you for coming on. Uh, please, shut yourself up if you'd like to. Go ahead. Uh yeah, check me out at uh, uh some ordinary gamers guys. Take care. I'm gonna I'm gonna go do some crack. Good night guys. <laughs> Good luck. Good night. <laughs> Too mad. You have been eliminated as well. You wanna shut yourself out? Thank you for coming on. Jesus <laughs> God. Honestly, I don't blame him. Actually, Leslie, what the? F- I had a what? question about like Too mad, but I wasn't that shameless. You know what I mean? Like I tried to I'm be. Just gotta go shit. hard. I could not believe I made it far, man. Affirmative action is working. <laughs> Actually true. <laughs> uh, Turkey Tom, legend of winning. Congratulations to both contestants. You have made it to the final round of the greatest, the biggest, the best show on kick. Kick or keep. Best show, worst producer. Let's go. Okay, dickhead. It's the best show because it's got the best producer, Jack. Number one. Number so two, why are you farming chat? Here, why are you farming chat? I thought you were a YouTuber. Why are you doing like Dude, the streamer I'm not farming shit? Farming chat. Chat I don't even shit. know what your chat's saying. It's not my chat. You're farming the chat. Uh, Ooh, wow. like little Steve right here. Jesus. Over here. I can't wow. even I, see wait, his stream, I, I can't talk like that? Okay. By the way, Lo, you did say if you don't know me, like you, don't, like you didn't need to make that intro. I do know you. I do follow your basketball takes. Terrible. Oh, mostly. wow. Wow. Yeah, but listen. You're entitled to your takes, you know what I mean? But, guys, I want to ask you this. And it's basically since, listen, when, when we get to the end, I usually let, let you guys go back and forth, but I've dealt with it enough today, so I'm going to give you a question. I'll guide you guys through it. <clears throat> Fusi, you guys are aware of him, right? Fusi too. Yeah, for sure. Recently gone super viral. Do you think, wait, hold on, hold on, let me read it perfectly for you guys. Fusi yeah, had yeah. a wild week during his subathon. Yes, I write. Thank you. Thank mm-hmm. you. Not Floyd. 
Fusi had a wild week during his subathon. He got kicked out of his hotel, walked in the middle of a busy freeway, and swatted himself after threatening to kill a streamer that had been trolling him. Is it ethical for commentary channels to profit off of his escalating manic episode, and should Kick be platforming it? Um, do you want to go first? Go ahead. Actually, I want to hear, because we might actually disagree, which might make this even better. Really? Okay. Well, as a commentary channel, we actually had a conversation on Destiny's stream about this the other day. And ultimately, my take is that I don't think that I am responsible for what FooseyTube does. Um, as far as the platform themselves, they can make their own decision. I'd probably argue they shouldn't get involved. I think that's a, a difficult standard to enforce, realistically. But as far as me, I don't think I'm responsible for what FooseyTube does. Fousey's repeatedly shown himself to be at least somewhat cognitively aware of his own actions. He decides to make poor decisions anyway and live stream. He's around a bunch of people who are clearly enabling him. And as me, as someone who's not interacting, I don't think I have any kind of responsibility to not make content about it. Now, that being said, there was a guy I saw who, uh, shout out Go Kanaru, who did a good clip on this. There's a guy who was like actively calling Fousey to being like, yo, I just sent your girlfriend there or whatever. Like she's, you know, hired by me, which is feeding into Fousey's delusions. Now that is horrible. That's not okay. That's not cool. That guy, you know, I don't really give a shit what happens to him, frankly, because I think that's just completely degenerate. Um, but as far as what I or a commentary channel has to do, I don't think we hold any ethical responsibility to cover or not cover Fousey. That being said, the way you cover it is important. If you're encouraging harassment, if you're encouraging people to go IRL to fuck with him, if you're calling him feeding into his delusions, that's horrible. If you're just talking about it, I don't think there's anything wrong. That's my take. So no, you you don't believe we should have any any we hold any responsibility at all. Um, I mean, undoubtedly, there's a little bit of responsibility. Do you have to yeah. act on that? No, the responsibility that everyone holds is like technically by giving it attention, you feed into it. But so does the rest of the world. So does everyone else. You're never gonna ever want to stop. Yeah. Um, and also like once again, Fusi wants to be famous. He loves the attention. He likes this. This is something he actively wants. Yeah. This isn't someone who's like a private person being harassed on live stream. This is someone who's a public person who enjoys the attention, who enjoys people on him, who feeds into it, who calls Keemstar and tells him that uh, Keemstar made him want to kill himself, okay, on live stream. This is the kind of person we're dealing with. I don't have a lot of empathy for someone in that position, frankly. Yeah, right, so yeah, let me, I don't have empathy for him either, but I think the, I think the question is like, and also platforms, I don't really care. I think it's more interesting to talk about like us as commentary channels. Okay. Um, from my, from my point of view, there is, obviously there is a level of responsibility that we, we hold, especially when we're talking about somebody who clearly is, um, wanting attention, like, and us feeding into that conversation is aiding him in the process of train wrecking. We all know that that's what's happening right now. Right. And I know on playback, we've made decisions to not cover certain people because it is going to um, add to whatever momentum that they're going to have that then will lead to potentially some form of detriment. And I, we are on the brink of just deciding not to re, you know, report on Fousey or say anything about Fousey moving forward because how much it escalated in the last episode. Now, this isn't like something that I'm expecting any and everybody to do, but I do feel like there is a part of me just as a human where I feel like not only monetizing off of somebody who's having a train wreck is like morally from my point of view like a really bad thing to do i remember we were we were recording somebody i remember we got done with the video and i was like i felt so bad that by the end of the video when we kept reporting on it it kind of like tailed off the energy and you just felt genuinely bad about the person and in terms of fuzi i'm not too familiar on him since his last manic episode when he's standing on the car with his shirt pulled up and he's just screaming. Yeah. I don't know what he's been doing since then, but the more and more information I've learned about him, I didn't know he went in rehab. I didn't know he was, you know, self deletion thought about self deleting and really close to doing so. I had people talk him out of it. I didn't know the amount of people that he had around him who also tried to walk him off the ledge. I didn't know how severe it was until recently. And because of how severe it is, I do believe that taking my, um, my platform being more responsible with it and removing it from him so he doesn't receive then on the a wave of onslaught. Now, we could be a drop in the bucket of, you know, YouTube shenanigans that happens on going on, but I do feel kind of up knowing that I am adding to what's happening and it's very clearly he's having he's in the middle of like progressing i guess to me it's like an episode i agree drop in the bucket but if you actually want to be a force for good and you don't want to actually fit into that i feel like you could cover it in a responsible way that actually informs people about the issue at hand lets them know what's going on and you're not going to just content farm you're not going to get people to go watch a stream and cheer on his downfall you can make a serious video that's like hey this is really f***ed up. This guy's going through a lot, and you could talk about the social media machine, and then you could inform your audience a little bit about your perspective. You can inform them about why it's wrong that Fousey's doing this, and you could give a good take to your audience and just let them know, like, hey, this is f***ed up. And I think, would you feed into it a little bit? Yes. But the way Fousey wants people to feed into it is 
undoubtedly, undoubtedly from everything he's done is by creating more drama, fueling more drama, and helping that. I think that by raising awareness for the situation, yep. by talking about it in a responsible way, let's say you did release that video you're talking about with this person, and you like you get to mm-hmm. the end, and you're like, man, this is just sad. You could post that, and that would probably be like a meaningful thing for viewers to see and be like, god damn, like, maybe this is kind of up. And if you the, just don't the cover problem, it, they're just going to watch the next guy. Yeah, but the problem with Fousey is that even because I think that is how we took the approach of the last video we did, where like it's kind of f-ed up. Like I hope you get better, da da da, in a more serious vein. The problem is Fousey is that he'll even use that in his advantage as well, and almost leverage the idea of like you know mental health, and now da da da, and now like that's just like another arc of the train wreck that he's going through that he's now utilizing that and leveraging into his favor, and all of it is just a part of something much bigger. So Fousey is like a, a very unique situation where even if you try to be serious, even if you are so, because there's like actual examples of people on the phone with him being serious, telling him to stop between Jadeon, Aiden Ross. I think a, a handful of people called him and tell him like, yo, stop. And he even has the ability to use that as content and then use that to forward it onto something else because he knows it's just all a part of something much bigger that he doesn't mind. I don't know if he minds because then he starts to cry and I'm like, I don't know even if that's real or not. So instead of me like being involved in trying to figure out what's real, what's not, what's best for him, what's not best for him, I know for a fact removing myself completely just to detach me so much so to where I know I'm not involved. And I think it, regardless of when it comes to Fusi, he doesn't care. He doesn't care if it's good involvement, bad yeah. involvement. So it's positive. That, if you telling him instructively, he just doesn't care. Everything will be destructive to him. I guess I'm glad that that makes you feel good. But in practice, I don't think that actually has any like demonstrable effect on the situation in, in a positive or negative way. I think you covering him is mostly neutral as long as you do it the right way with someone as famous as him. And as a result, I think that that's only going to like, you know, you can go to sleep at night and feel a little better about yourself maybe because you feel like you didn't feel this. But end of the day, if you, if you, let's say you're criticizing someone like Fresh and Fit, Fresh and Fit actually want to be criticized because it makes them more famous. They may DMCA people sometimes, but end of the day, that notoriety only helps them. Um, and you're, you're, you're only giving them more of an audience by people. Let's say someone goes and sees your video and says, oh, I actually think these Fresh and Fit guys are kind of based okay they go watch them ultimately it may make you feel a little bit better like when you hug your teddy bear at night you're like oh i didn't hurt you know fussy tube today but in practice i don't think it does much i don't think the consequences are positive or negative i don't think you actually help or change anything i think it's mostly like i don't want to say morally grandstanding because i don't think you're grandstanding i think you genuinely feel this way but Mm -hmm. it's, it's almost like grandstanding to yourself it's like oh i did a good thing but really like you did kind of a neutral thing it's like it just doesn't really it doesn't really matter you know but the, the the only thing that I have the biggest pushback is that it's not like Fusi Two wasn't creating content or doing anything, you know, like five months ago or even yeah. a year ago or two years ago. Is the fact that like he was doing things, he was having episodes. Again, I just learned that he was self had thoughts of self deletion, dealt with um, drugs, dealing with money problems, and all those things. You can go on the internet and find him when it happened real time mm-hmm. while while he was going through it, him recounting a lot of those things. But because nobody was like reporting those things nobody talked about those things nobody effectively cared they all went under the radar and he went through his life in as much of a constructive way as possible because there was nothing that was pulling him away right. from the constructive but, progress but the last time he had a manic episode he tried to scam a bunch of people into thinking that drake was going to show up at his event and the only reason that people knew that he wasn't going to be there is because people raised awareness if nobody had talked about that and you know quote unquote fed into oh well stuff like that no no him. yes but stuff like that but how long ago was that it was like five years ago no yeah, but who's to say like, he won't do also, something like that tomorrow? Oh, no, no. I'm, if he does that, then yes, raise awareness to that. What I'm saying is from that manic episode to where we are now, or the last month and the two, there's been several things that he's been going on through his life, but nobody really cared about it. Nobody said anything about it. And he was doing crazy things that's then. That's true. And, probably, and the fact probably, that nobody wasn't reporting on it. And that's why it never got the attention. On it is because Wait, hold he on. Tom, he wasn't Tom, meeting let me sex trafficking victims oh, at the airport let me ask and getting them in the bathroom. Shut up, nigga. I said, let me ask you a question, you Holy! I don't respect you. Doing it on purpose right now. Okay, then stay muted while I talk. If actually you're unmuted, okay. Let me ask you this. Let me ask you this, right? You you're right now claiming that hey, Fusi's doing all of this because he likes the content. It's entertaining. It's fun. Like he's feeling the fire. Do you really think this guy was feeling the dude that tried swatting him and called his mother's house and said, "Hey, I'll slit your throat." You really think that Fusi was playing into that as well? Um, I mean. To a degree, it gets him more attention. Like, if he, if he, no, 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 you, you shut the f- up. If he really wanted to avoid it, if he really wanted to live a nice private life where none of this sh- happens, he would get the f- away. 
and he doesn't. He's going to come right back out when he's out of the mental hospital, fire up a live stream, go f another girl at the airport in the bathroom that was a trafficking victim and was drunk at the airport. Then he's going to lie after the fact, say it didn't happen and cry on stream. That's what he's going to do. So I don't give a f okay? F pussy tube. Wait, hold on. Let me ask you this then. So if somebody is a YouTuber or a streamer, for instance, and they keep getting DDoS, right? Would you recommend them to like stop streaming if you can't actually hold up your stream and just go find another job? Because right now what you're pretty much saying is, hey, you know no, what? No, Fousey is giving you a hard time. Someone actively invites it. If you're a friendly little, you know, Stephen Bonnell. He Legends actively invites doxing? Out. Dude, he's actively punching people on oh, stream. He's inviting COVID. the toxicity. And he's that punching people on live stream. He's f***ing these girls. He's calling Keemstar saying crazy sh you, you actively dictate what your audience does. There are fluke incidents, okay? Do you think it's a you think it's any coincidence that people are actively trying to f with oh. people, what, trying to f with Fousey Tube in particular on this issue? I've never had someone try to do that to me. I've never even been f swatted. Fousey Tube is inviting this. Sh he thrives off the attention. I don't feel f bad for him at all, okay? But the, but the fact that nobody was reporting on him like the last two to three years is proof. He wasn't that doing anything. If he though. doesn't, but but he didn't start this stretch right here. Of women in airports everything was like it all started and it slowly grind cr climbed to him getting to that point and the only reason why it slowly climbed to that point is because more and more people started giving him attention start reporting on it and then because he didn't it didn't like he started oh yeah first string back in the airport that's not how that happened everything yeah, but, 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 but this to is this a moment. pattern of behavior for him as far as like liking like liking with hookers and stuff like that being a addict and on top of that like do you think there's any way you can stop people from giving him that attention? Even if we didn't talk about him, he'd have so many like, he viewers just went on stream. Three, he, just, he just went three years with nobody giving a f about him. Yeah, because he wasn't streaming. He yep. wasn't doing anything. He was just chilling. He was. He was He, he was, was streaming. He was, he was, he was, he was, streaming. He was, he was uploading was videos. He was doing interviews. All He was still yep. around. Was he doing crazy? Just yeah. that he... Uh, I mean, he talked about how he, again, almost self-deletion, how he went to massage parlors, getting his dick jacked well, off all the time. doing crazy shit and, on stream? Like, actively doing No, but what I'm saying, I, but again, again, he, I think he only got to this point is because the lead up to where we are now. He didn't start the like first stream. I feel like he's responsible for crazy. his own actions. I don't think he's... No, really he's responsible. I'm not saying he's not responsible. The question is how, our responsibility, how we are held accountable. I think we have none. Or what we did. Uh, yeah, I don't, I don't think we have none. Yo, let the... I see the straw pull up. Let's get this affirmative action going, man. I'm black, he's up. white. Let's get my votes. <laughs> I'm in, Chinese, man. and frankly, they didn't let me our... into college for the last 20 years. So let me the freak in. Votes okay? coming in. They didn't let me in college yeah, for like next, my next, my 80, 80, 80, 80, 80, 80 years. So my we're good, man. Okay, on the next episode, kid, we're gonna aggressively mute these guys. Are just shameless. Okay, absolutely shameless. Especially this turkey, Tom. I want you to keep it's this muted till the okay? end. Not only. Yeah. Okay, not only should we aggressively mute them, it should be time mutes too. Like when you get muted, you're muted for like a whole like two minutes, okay? Because God damn. Absolutely. These guys Wait, Tom, what, Tom, what's your thoughts on this? On what? Being Shut muted. the f up. It doesn't matter, <laughs> nigga. Stay f muted, okay? I'm posting again in chat. This is our final poll to determine the winners. Good luck, guys. Our final poll to determine the winners. I agree that. with you that he he holds his own accountability, but the question was like us as commentators, and so I don't I don't think we have zero. Or I don't think we have so little. I just, that I just don't think I have I have any responsibility for what other people do. If you actively encourage, yeah, but you can't control everyone. You can't control the world. I'm not gonna sure. spend my life trying to make sure that everyone does the right thing. Like I tell my audience to do the right thing. If they don't, that's not my fault, you know. Um, so also, Q, fun. you need to get fired. Okay, you need to get. Fired, and uh, I hope oh, that the wow. Pakistani yeah, government. Yeah, the white man trying to take a black man's job, ladies and gentlemen. Nothing but has you're changed. You're not black, bro. Oh, I, I don't even know that you're black, dude. You could be lying. Wait, what is blackness to you? Do I need to be born in the Bronx or something? I can't even see is your face, black, bro. You? you could be anything. You could be wearing a skin suit. Right I mean, now. listen, I've said it plenty of times. Okay, I am 100 African. I've said That's it as too, black as it gets. I'm white, so I don't know what the. You are. You look like a mistake, buddy. First of all, why is your fro <laughs> arm much darker than the rest of the I was body? I was going to say that, but I was going to let it rock. Yeah, why, 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 <laughs> is like, your facial hair darker? No, your forearm. No, your, your forearm. forearm. It's it like so you much darker than the rest. Right yeah, dude, now. it's because I, exactly. I got tan. I go outside, unlike you, who just sits in here sucking Destiny's dick all day while Melina's out hanging out damn. with this dude. Okay? Oh, damn. Wait, what? Why are you right. just saying? <laughs> sorry, damn, sorry. Like you said Stop. something. Hey, we have a winner for the show. All right, good job. You guys did great today, but actually, you know what? Legend of Winning, you did great today. Turkey Time, you talk way too much. You talked over the moderators all the time. I would dock you votes if this wasn't the last round, okay? Because you don't deserve them, all right? 
You've just been wow. completely unreal today. But I would like to say congratulations to Turkey Tom for being the most annoying piece of shit here. However, Legend of Winning, you have the better YouTube channel, but you also lost. I'm sorry. Turkey Tom. Oh! Hey. Oh, Congratulations to Turkey Tom, man. Oh, Congratulations to the white man. Get again winning. Of course, it's your community, but we need to talk about this later. Anyways, congratulations, Turkey. What is this nigga doing? Like, really? This makes us look bad, by the way. This, this, this okay, stop. Like, or something. Okay. Holy. Sorry. Yo, you were, you were good, bro. I, I, yeah, I was nervous, honestly. I was nervous. You did a really good job. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Yeah, respect. Um, I guess I had to give my farewells. Oh uh, yeah, thank you all for having me. Um, uh, it was great talking to y'all. Good, you know, I I do know who you are, Q. So I thank you for your support. I didn't know you really watch me or not, man. I just saying, you know, I think just chatting. You. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Uh, shout out to y'all. Thank you for having me. Shout out to Turkey. Shout out to the chat. Um, I don't stream anyway, so I didn't need 500 subs. So man, congratulations. Damn. Wow. <laughs> but uh, I'll catch y'all later, man. Hopefully, I can come on the next one or whatever y'all do next. But thank y'all. Absolutely. Thank you for coming right. on. For sure. Wait a second. Turkey, Turkey you piece of shit. Does he, he doesn't stream? On okay, kick? Nope. Nope, no, he just PayPal the nigga. Actually, Turkey YouTube, Tom I stream on YouTube. YouTube since... Nigga, he ain't giving you nothing on YouTube. YouTube don't pay this nigga. It's a kick show. <laughs> it's meant to be subs on kick. Holy Well, oh, if only the host had communicated that to any of the guests. Oh. Uh, I think he wanted what? No, don't, don't, no, 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 stop. Let's see, I can't stop. give him a prize. Uh, he's get a prize for no, winning? wait, stop. Wait, 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 stop. One second, one second. Turkey, let's negotiate. You know what I mean? One mil subs. You don't need 500. Just say I give it to Q this week. You know what I mean? Put <laughs> <laughs> it on to Q. No. Show some goodwill. You bitch. Okay. Listen, I tried. I tried. Okay. PayPal him 500. Okay? I'm going to send that money to whatever your okay. religious opposition is so they can kill your people. Okay? <laughs> oh, He's donating that money okay. right to America. <laughs> <laughs> Or kick.com slash slicker, by the way. It's the same idea. That's going to my quarter Shout out three to tax people. payment. Ooh. Well, Wait, $500 would pay your taxes? Dude, it's just part of it, YouTube okay? must not be paying good. YouTube must not be paying You're good. You're wearing bro. a rag on your head with poop on it, bro. F you. Should I send you my Gucci, PayPal? Yeah. Gucci, Gucci, oh, Prada. Oh poop God. on it. Where's the poop? Other than the slight bit of my skin that's showing again. You just called me skin. Destiny, Are you a fan of Hassan? Uh, okay, okay. You watch Hassan Abi? I will Jeez. DM you my PayPal email. Um, wow, well, you really chose you, you really chose an amount one hundred dollar lower than um, the requirement to file a W nine for someone, which is probably pretty smart. Wow, thanks. Or it literally could just be five hundred dollars a nice brown number, and who the f cares about IRS IRS limits on tax filings? But thank you. Um, I don't apparently, know you because you, you brag about overpaying taxes like a little. Okay. Who brags about overpaying? I complain about overpaying taxes. You were like, I'm from California. I overpay my taxes. Okay, I'm a good guy. That's why I left California. F that cringe. Welcome to Where do you live? What state do you live? Uh, I, I don't want to get into this, bro. Okay, listen. I'm currently oh living in Canada. God, do I don't want to explain it. I don't want to go into this. Oh, international tax fraud. I got you, bro. I got you. I I'm am from you. Maine originally, okay? I'm from Maine. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay, is this like fucking session over? Just send the nigga his money so he could get out of here. Yeah, Turkey Tom. Bro, you're gonna get the out of here again. Too. Nobody knows who the I, you are. I'm famous. I, honestly, bitch. maybe oh. you need maybe you need maybe you need the Manscaped sponsor. Honestly, you. I don't even know what you shit. look Those like, bro. Are, holy, shit. like goddamn, I could make a T-shirt off out of that. Shit. Anyways, I'm worth a lot. I'm famous. Okay? You said I'm famous like part. I didn't find out about you when I was looking for people on this panel. You might be famous to like. 15 year olds buddy but i don't know who the f you are other than you know Bro, you're 30 you you're 38 years old on this live stream dude i'm 20 i make more money than buddy, you. Sorry, I'm between 21. me and you between me and you are a rough looking 21 i could have put all my money that you were 28 which wait there's no way know, target time is 21 years old i'm, this I'm 21 what do you mean bro holy no shot, he is. Oh no more God. taking him seriously anymore. You didn't believe you thought I'm, I don't look geriatric. Leave me the f alone, bro. Oh my goodness. <laughs> There's anyway. no response. Well, I'm I won. I don't have to get roasted on the stream. Well, Night's fun. I like it. I like it. Okay. Well, good job. Good luck. We are, we're proud of you. I don't know what the f I'm supposed to say. Why is this f 
So here. Usually, yeah, that's what you, I'm, wait. I'm usually, when I leave, you say, <laughs> I love you, buddy, and I say, I love you too. Oh, right, he's you, one of those people. I love you, buddy. Oh, Stay yikes. safe, okay? I love you too. Stay safe. Q, yep. go. Be a better producer. <laughs> And if you liked this video, consider becoming a member. For $5 a month, you get access to exclusive podcasts, unreleased videos, and the members-only Minecraft server. Thanks so much to all of my YouTube members who fund my content.